All right, we are live. Uh, my dude's having some technical difficulties. So um, we're going to wait for him to come in here. And um, I may have a backup, too. So we'll see how it goes down. Sometimes we have these issues with the technical difficulties. So, um, you know, I'm going to show you guys some LeBrons. And we'll see how it goes down. Hopefully he comes through. If not, you know, if you guys want to talk about anything, we'll talk about it. But I have about 10 sneakers here. So we'll show off some kicks. If anyone has a sneaker collection they want to show off, please do so. So um, first shoe I'm going to show is some LeBron 2s right here. So we got some LeBron 2s. Check it out. And shout out to everyone in the chat. This is the LeBron 2 All-Star. LeBron 2 All-Star. A lot of people want to see these come back. How do you feel about that? Do you want to see the LeBron 2 come back or you could care less about the LeBron 2? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat because I do want to know. What do you think about the LeBron 2? Uh, we got the first member in here. Salute to all the members here on the channel if you want to join be part of the dj dell squad the sneaker rally crew team dj dells there's the membership button below join and make sure to hit the thumbs up button but yeah let me know in the comments let me know on the playback what do you think of these right here you want them back or you can care less about them lebron too and if you're watching on the playback Right, you know, LeBron too. Eh, they're okay. Or a hot fire flames. Throw some fire emojis. Clint Stewart, what's good, my friend? Salute to you. So, check it out. The LeBron 2. I don't think this has ever really released as far as a retro. Any LeBron 2s. We got 7s. We got 8s around the corner. So, we shall see in the future how it goes down. Um, and I'm hoping that uh, my dude comes through. If not, I, I got some shoes to show. So let me see if you guys know your LeBron. So let me know what LeBron this is right here. And I'll put a link if anyone wants to cam up. Feel free to. There's a link right there. Check it out. Let me know what LeBron this is, if you know. Looks like no one knows what LeBron this is, which is fine. Not everyone's a big LeBron fan. This right here is the LeBron 5. This is the LeBron 5 right here. St. Vincent, St. Mary, LeBron 5. Nice shoe. Crazy suede's on it. Oh, our guest is here. Look at that. I was warming up the show for you. Say it ain't so. We got say it. Say it with your kicks. <laughs> what's up, my friend? What's, what's up, Dells? How's everything, bro? I know you weren't going to let me down. You're here. Nah, nah. I was just having issues because of the whole iPhone situation, but you know, I I made it. I'm here. I'm here. Jonathan, you gotta you gotta fall back. We'll see you another time, buddy. Because my <laughs> my guest is here right now. Um, so man, you're a diehard LeBron fan, and uh, let me ask you a question. What's up? How did it feel to have LeBron James shout you out on on IG? Because he shouted <laughs> you out on IG. Bro, that was crazy because I, I wasn't expecting that. I just went in the live because he was on. And then he noticed it. He noticed me right away. And then once he shouted me out, I was like, wait, hold up, what? Like, it was crazy. Like, <laughs> like, the only one in the house that time was my cat. So he didn't even know what was going on. <laughs> but it was yo, I, I mean, I would have bugged out if he was like, yo, DJ Dells, I see you. Because like, <laughs> that's what he was like, yo, I appreciate the support. So he yeah. knew you, and he's seen how you repping heavy. I thought that was really dope. Um, by the way, guys, let's hit the thumbs up button so we can get more people in here. If you could tweet this, share this on social media, it would mean the world to me so we can get more people in here. 
So, um, yeah, I was showing some LeBrons before you came in here. I was like the opening act. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I showed these. Showed these. Just warming it up for you. So uh, what, what you got to show, bro? Well, all right. So I'm going to go with the Palmers. Because I don't really show these a lot. I feel like. Yeah, people them. don't show. And I actually had these two in hand. <laughs> Cause yeah. I, cause I didn't know, you know. God forbid, there's like um, technical difficulties. I had to warm it up before you got here, so nah, it's good. Yeah, so we got the Pullmans, the twelve lows. This is the only pair of lows I own, cause I don't really buy lows like that. But these right here, I had to. Mm -hmm. These are fire. Yeah, there was a fire, bro. Mm -hmm. Like these need to come back out on like another, probably on like an eighteen or something. Yeah, that's a it's a sick print on it, right? The print mm -hmm. on them is, is crazy on it. Yeah, it's it's something that like you don't see a lot. Uh-huh. Then I have these that we don't see a lot neither. The twos, the bread twos. Sick. Yo, fresh, I gotta get you later on. All right, bro, because he's showing his LeBrons. I know you don't have unless you got a few LeBrons you want to show. If you want to hang out backstage for now, you let me know. Then I have, hold up. I ain't even wear these. Yeah. IG DM. I ain't even wear these. Oh yeah, those are so, I I those are fire, right? I love the basket weave on those. I know you know these. <laughs> yeah. yeah, these are crazy. I got these for, from eBay for like a steal, bro. Like, it was same like with one, me. Same it's with like me, one fifty. Um, it's crazy how these shoes. They, they, you could find them for under retail, you know what I mean? Like, like nothing, you know? Yeah. And then I got these right here, the mints, the 10 mints. Mm, hold on. Let me make it full size. I haven't seen those in a long time. <laughs> hey, these, you're on your phone, right? Yeah. Can you turn your phone to the side so we can All get right. it widescreen? Thank yeah. you. There we go. No doubt. Beautiful. Yeah. Ten mints. These are like I only wear these on special occasions because I don't really want to dog them out like that. Yeah, those those are dope and, and very comfortable, man. That mm -hmm. if I'm not mistaken, that was the first full length zoom we really got, right? Yep. Like the full length zoom. Here's some threes. Someone wanted threes. Here you go. The threes. So they want threes. Pain. There you go, pain. I got a pair of threes too. Hold up. All right. <laughs> Let me know in the chat in the comments. You know which ones these are. I got the you all star three. Woo! Oilers. Those yep. are dope. <laughs> I ain't even wear these yet neither. I'm just waiting for the right. For the those right are so, so sick, man. I love those. Hell yeah. And plus, like, people don't wear these every day neither. And it's crazy because this is a fire shoe. Like, Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I'm surprised those didn't sell as well. I know, me neither. It was disrespectful, kind of. Like, all these retros just going on sale and nobody's paying mind to them. It's crazy. There we go, Henry. It's too crazy. Yeah, they like these kicks we showing. <laughs> but yeah, and then There's I have a these. that comes on here. Chill Town, he goes by. He's got a great LeBron collection. You would love to see his stuff too. Oh, I haven't seen those in a while. <laughs> this yeah, is a lot. I haven't seen those in forever. <laughs> Hell yeah. I know. What was the upper on that? What it was material denim. It's, it's, it's denim. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mm -hmm. And it had on the tongue, it had like a nice leather, right? Yeah. See, look, you got both of them right here. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, take your time with those, unless you got a date or something. Exactly. <laughs> take your time. Show them things, man. <laughs> you got a few more? What? What's up? That's it. That's all I got. I only put. I only brought out five. <laughs> Come on, show us a couple of more, bro. Come on. Another, another. And we're gonna get into my dude Fresh Kicks. He's up. He's backstage right now. He's uh, setting his camera up. I see him. And um, he's getting some SBs together. This guy got some great dunks. So I know he's getting his camera steady so he can just chill and show off the kick. So 
Oh yeah. Come on, you can't be done yet. I know you you come on LeBron James screaming out your name, bro. Come on, bro. We got the all-star sevens right here, bro. Yeah. Here, I'll these, show a pair of two right here. These are Some crazy. Bomb, bomb. I, I still got to get the 2020, I mean, the yeah, the 2020 pair that came out this year. I'll show you these. This is the OG pair. I'll show you these. Yeah. What else we got? Hold on. Look at the LeBron, young LeBron. <laughs> Yeah, those are fire. Those needed to come back out. These people want these to come back out too. Yeah, everybody want those. But then we got oh yeah. These, you know, there you go. Come on, man. I'm like, <laughs> the, you you the, the, M case, the MVP bro. sevens, bro. Fire. <laughs> show you some some others. Oh, those thirteens were fire, but they hurt my feet, bro. Like, they hurt everyone's feet, man. <laughs> There's no yo. one in the world that things don't hurt. You know what I mean? <laughs> For real. You got oh, these wait. joints. Hold up, I'll cool you with these on. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'll cool you with these on. I gotta shut the lights. Oh, all right. Oh, he Yo, out. it's flashlight. If you're looking for it, everyone and their mama needs one of these. Linked in the description box. The UV light. The exact one I'm using. Look at that. Look how sick that glows. I barely Yo, hit that's it. that's fire. That's Yo, you, fire. everyone needs one of these lights, bro. They're, it's incredible. That's fire. Everyone needs one of these lights, man. These are sick. Those are crazy. Yeah. The big oh, game oh, nines. Oh, man. Yep, incredible. I got these. A, oh, yeah. And that was so disrespectful how, how that thing <laughs> sat, right? I Could know. You, yo, if you told me years ago that they're going to come out with a retro and they're going to sit, I would tell you you were on drugs. I would I would have, <laughs> my dad asked me to laugh. You are on yeah, okay. serious drugs. <laughs> young, young, um, young Jonathan, not right now, buddy, okay? But thank you, man. And we got my boy Fresh Kicks on deck. He's going to show his Nike SBs. It's going to be epic. You got a few more to show? Okay. Yes, I just I got to take your hand in that box. Let's I go. Got, I got Guys, my hit the favorite. thumbs up button. We're showing sneakers here. Come on. My, my oh, my I know what that Ron, is. The, the, yeah. The turfs. Oh, those you know? are stupid. Hold on. Let me, go, <laughs> let me go full screen. Yeah. Yeah, those are sick. I love these, Give bro. Give us a good like, look on those. This is my favorite 15. Hold on. I got you right now. Yeah. Woo. Then you got the strap. I love that strap, man. Poor no, this this oh, idea, no. this idea was crazy. Like whoever came up with this, that was that was Dude, but probably killing it. It's probably Jason Petrie who's doing all this. Yeah. Um, because yo, the, even that four that came out this year with the four midsole and outsole was stupid. Oh, it was so yeah. crazy. It looked like a like a whole different shoe, like yeah, but with the four, it was sick. Mm -hmm. You want to hang out for a minute while and show while my dude Fresh Kick shows some dunks? Yeah, sure, why not? All right, we're gonna bring my boy Fresh Kicks up in here. Fresh kicks. What's good? What's good, What's fam? Up, guy? Say it with your up? kicks. What's good, bro? What's up, bro? How's What's going you on, guys everybody? Know each other or no? Nah, we just chit chat nah. on the gram sometimes. But okay, okay, not cool, much. Cool. So my dude got some dunks. We definitely yeah. got to see what he got cooking. Yeah, let, I'm trying to decide how I want to start it off. Um, here we go. By far, one of the best mids ever made. Mm. Mm. White Widow. Sure, the suede Lord. is absolutely suede is ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Stash pocket. Oh, those are fire. Yeah. White Widows. Yeah, yeah the White Widows Crazy. by uh, Todd Bratrude. I think I, I'm not yep. exactly sure how to pronounce his last name. I don't think but... anyone really knows how to exactly pronounce it. Yeah, these are these Jonathan, joints. You're all good, brother. We just, we doing this right here. Collections. Uh, so that's those. Uh, that's probably one of my favorite mids. Period. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see what we got here. Oh yeah. 
Hold on, but oh yeah. Oh, the Halloween joint. The Halloweens, yeah. Mm -hmm. Those are ridiculous. The super cool thing about this is like you, you see the ghost, right? It's the little details that Nike SB does. Yeah. Look yeah. At that. Like that that is just so dope. And then the hat and then the jack-o'-lantern face. Yeah, mm -hmm. the perforations on the toe is yeah. great. And then, you know, the spider. Yeah, it's it's ridiculous, man. It crazy. comes with like all kinds of different laces. The insole. Let me show y'all the insole. This thing is nuts. If I can get it out. They're slowly getting back to where they're supposed to be. You know? Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. But with all the hype and everything, it's so whack, though. I know. That, like, look, and they're not making enough pairs. No, nah, they're wow. not. Like that, that's, the in, that's the guts of a pumpkin. That's so Jeez. dope. It's insane. I love it, bro. Uh, let's see. I'll fix that in a minute. All right. I'll show you some old school joints. Mm. Angels and demons. Yep. Damn near dead stop. Wow. I mean, I wore them a few times, but <laughs> super clean. Uh, let's see what else we got. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Sandy Bodecker. Yeah. Oh, really uh, nice. rest in peace, those, you showed me those when I seen you at the spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ray guns. Those yeah. Are, those are so you, you see that 58, right? Mm-hmm. That's also a nod and a salute to Sandy Bodecker because his initials were S A um, S B, Sandy oh, Bodecker. Okay. So the fifty-eight, that's that, super dope. One of my favorite lows in the collection that'll probably never go anywhere. Um, let's see what we got. Oh yeah, why not? I'm a diamond guy. Let's go. <laughs> Black diamonds. With the field laces. This quality on these is insane. Another cool ass detail. Yeah. Yeah. Removable swoosh. I wish they came with different color swooshes. That would have been super dope. Removables, you know. Oh, that, yeah. That would have been killer. But the, these are definitely up there. Um... Well, let's see. We got another one. Bang. Oh, Tiffany. Better than the lows, in my opinion. Ooh. I don't care what people say. <laughs> that was awesome. I'm a, I'm a, I like the highs better than the lows. Super dope. Um, all right, y'all ready for this? Let's go. Let's see it. Let's see it. I, I, I've got a. Banger! Oh, I oh, got them both. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Apples. Yes, sir. Super dope pairs. Super glad I was able to finally get these in a trade. Nonetheless, I didn't have to come out of pocket. No crazy amount of money. Just traded a few shoes, and dude was like, "Yeah, let's do it." Obviously, yes, they've been worn. They're not dead stock. I didn't want a dead stock pair after it being from two thousand and five. You can't really trust pairs after that long, yeah. you know, that long of a time. I didn't want to have to deal with no re-gluing and this and that, yada, yada. Mm -hmm. So when I got them in, I sent them to my boy in Washington. Shout out to NSB Soul Searching. If y'all um, have Instagram, check him out. NSB underscore Soul Searching. Super great dude. Great uh, restoration guy. One of the top out in, the, in this market. But he re-glued everything, cleaned them up really good, repainted a few spots, and I mean they're they're there. So you wait a minute. So SBs deal with you deal with soul separation with SBs? It all really just depends on the condition of like, especially like guys that skate and stuff. Like the dude that I got these from, mm. he, he had got them from a skater. Oh, okay. And, I mean, they weren't, like, mutilated or destroyed, but they had been skated. And that's right. fine. I'm fine with that. They were perfectly fine with me. Um, it wasn't really the soul separation. They were just getting beat a little bit. Well, yeah, but, I mean, they got cleaned up real well. Hold on. Okay. I got a few more I want to show off. That one. That one. That one. Okay. All right, y'all ready? Let's go. Corduroys. 
Or yeah. Dusty, Dusty Peach. Those are sick. Yeah. Super dope quality on these. Suede is really nice. The corduroy is, is you know, top of the line. Corduroy tongue. I mean, these are these are definitely a keeper. <clears throat> Another sleeper. Oh, yeah. Those are fire. Firecrackers. It says caution flammable. One, the back of the other shoe says caution, and this one says flammable. Firecracker insoles. I don't know if you really can see. I, I doubt these will come out. Uh, I did yeah. something really stupid to my pair. Firecracker okay. insoles. That's how I, I was. Like uh, I was drinking on the Fourth of July wearing them. Oh no! <laughs> and, I, and I put I I put the fire. You put the firecracker oh, out with God. your shoes. I put firecrackers <laughs> in the shoe and it burnt the line. <laughs> oh, oh my God! I was but, so intoxicated. <laughs> But this this is a super. I have it on shoe. video too. You can search it. Just search the sneaker attic, firecracker. Um, and I filmed it close up of them blowing up inside the shoe. I still wear them, but I can feel a little bit of the melted material. Oh, I bet. I bet. <laughs> Got so, another one here. Yeah. Green taxi. I'm sorry for <laughs> the shitty. Hold hurt. on. Let me see if I can get the light. Right. Yeah, that's fine. Hang on, Green just a minute. Chilling. Guys, please hit that thumbs up button. Let's get more likes. And there details. we go. Oh, yeah. That's a hundred times better already. <laughs> My bad. It's all good. I hit you spur of the moment. Pause. Yeah. All right. Uh, Air Customs. Oh, yeah. Oh, I used to have those. those too. Uh, I swear you better not pull out the Thai temples, man. Oh, that nah, color nah. is fire. I, I, don't, I don't have them. Yeah, those came but, out at the same time. Those in the Thai temple. Yeah, yeah. I, I had both of them. I have old reviews on those shoes too. Customs. Yeah. Thai All temple. Right. I can't believe I got rid of those, man. There's a lot of pairs that I got rid of um, over the last year and a half because, you know, I tore my ACL last yeah. year. So I had to do something to keep the bills paid. That's okay, right. green taxis. Here we go. Here's a little better view of the green taxis. Yeah, those are sick. All right, so for the finale, y'all ready for this? Let's see it. It's going to be something crazy. Oh, oh yeah. No. <laughs> wow. Oh, <man. laughs> Hold on. Let me, let me open it up. I love it. I love it. Right. Boom. What's good? Those are sick. Even wow. diamond lace locks. Those are crazy. Yeah, dude. Friends and family, Nick sent these to me um, two years ago, obviously, when they released. Um, I received my pair November the 6th, 20, uh, 2018. Um, and a funny story about this, okay? So I received this pair November the 6th. I was blown away. I almost started crying when I opened the box. Because I didn't know they were coming. You didn't come in that case and all of that? Or you no, put no, no, it no. I bought that case. Okay. Um, I didn't know they were coming. I knew something was coming, but I didn't know what. Okay? So when these arrived, I knew I seen the box. It said Diamond Supply Co. And I was like, all right, sweet. So I opened the box. The first thing I see is the little uh, canary yellow sticker, sneaker sticker that comes with that came with the shoes. And, uh, I, I mean, I lost it, dude. Absolutely lost it. You could and, imagine. Um, then later on, I was able to get the white and the black pair to, you know, complete the set. And then mm -hmm. I ended up selling the white pair because I just, I don't do well with white shoes. Yeah, so, I, don't think, uh, I think a lot of people don't do well with them. <laughs> yeah, so here, here's another, here's another cool, uh, under the back tab, it says Diamond. Oh, uh, that's dope. I never yeah, knew that. Fire. I don't know those. Yeah. So. Wow. And, they, and it says that on the black pair, too. Whoa. Oh, okay. Hold on. Oh, shit. I lost the camera. All right. Cricket. Hang on. Sorry, guys. All right. So the black pair is the same way. Yeah, that's dope. Oh, why the hell yeah, that's, that's fine. up so high? But, yeah, it's, it's the same way. It's pretty dope. Um, but yeah, so I got this pair on November the 6th, 2018. On November the 8th, I received another package from Diamond Supply Co. It was another pair of these. 
Stop wow. playing. He sent you two. I promise to God. I promise to God. So I'm That's an honest crazy. person. Dales knows me. I'm an honest person. Okay. I'll never take advantage of people. All Are right? you hitting back? So I, I hit him back. I said, Nick, I received a second pair. I know it's a mistake. What needs to be done? He said, yeah, um, Shafiq sent it to you by accident. Can you please send it back? Absolutely. Send me a, a shipping label and I got you. I'll send it back to you. I sent it back to him within a week and a half, maybe. I, I received another big ass box, a huge ass box. And um, that box was filled with all almost every single piece from the Family Guy Diamond Supply Collab. Wow, that's wow. really nice to him. Yeah, that's and dope. he's and he's looked out like I mean he sends me random stuff all the time. Um, he just did a hot sauce um, with um, Gr uh, Grandessa hot sauces. Shit, he needs to bring that my way. <laughs> he just released a hot sauce, and I just received it. Dude, Dales, I'm telling you. When I first tasted it, the first person I thought about was you. Yeah, that's right. Because I, I know thinking. you're all about hot sauce and hot chips and yeah, doing all I'm that crazy shit. Yeah, food expert. <laughs> yeah, so that, you know, that was really cool. And, you know, we just have a really good, you know, communication relationship, friendship. We're always chatting with each other in the DMs. And, um... It's just crazy that through sneakers, I've been able to meet, you know, meet some really cool people. Dale's personally um, yeah. and, you know, other people just through, you know, virtual. I've, you know. I've, I've talked to you so many times on the Internet and then you eventually met me. You know what I yeah, mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I, and mean, I am approachable. I ain't, I ain't on nah, that you, you definitely are. <laughs> that's for sure. For sure. He's ran into me, though, when I've been incognito, though, too. <laughs> Yeah, 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 with the kiddos. Put me down. <laughs> yeah. I'm just trying to run in real quick, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You incognito today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he hurries up real quick. But yeah, man, Um, appreciate you having me on, dude. No, appreciate of you letting me we've show been, off. We've been the watching dunks. this for a while. We've been wanting both of y'all on here. Um, I, I appreciate both of your time, man. Are you, 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 you don't want to show up a few more while you're here? Say it. Uh, um, you know how we are, Let's Come see. Come on, man. You got people in here. Uh, hold up. Smash that damn thumbs up button and show that love and support. Damn. Let me see. I'm going to take it back to the old school. They, they right. wanted a sneaker battle between the two of us, they were saying. Damn. I'm going to take, take it back to the old school. What y'all know about these? Okay. They're coming back with a penny three, too. Yeah. These are the twos. Oh, two! Wow, I'm bugging. Okay, that's the that's the Orlando Magic uh, pair home, or away home. I know away. Hold Listen, on, I never on. said I'm the sneaker expert. I said I'm the hold sneaker on, addict. Hold on. Yo, hold, hold on, hold on. I let's got go. Some, I got something that Dell's been having trouble with. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I, I need mean, those too. I need hold those too. Hold on. Hold on. Yo, I I hate those shoes <laughs> so much. Like I hate them so much. So oh, much. man. The feeling of hatred toward those. Hey, I got some bronze for you. Say with oh, your kids. Oh, there you go. What those? All right. Yeah. That's the mags. The, the mag yeah, 14s. Yeah, the the, the air glow mags. bottoms. Yeah. Come the on, air you, you ain't got nothing. Now you show them a bronze. I told you. <laughs> I had a few. Um, what else? Oh, yeah. Let's see. <laughs> hey, we can really, we can really see where the people's, uh, sneaker knowledge is. Let's see. Hang on. Now I have a fucking mess in my room. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Hey, what y'all know about these? <laughs> the atonics. <laughs> the Trans Am joints. Oh, Okay. I'm I'm Hold not on. the big guy with those pores. The, the, these these are old schools. I got the uh Kimolaju one joint. Oh okay, yeah. Those are dope. The fruity pebble fifteen. Uh oh, fruity pebbles. <laughs> yeah, you love those thirteens. Oh yeah. I know you were pushing those heavy. Anyone want to cam up and show speakers, please do so. And then I got the the white pair for the diamond turf. Oh, you got them all. Hold nice. On, yep. Hey, 
Hang on just a second. This young buck one. Hold on, Tristan. Let me see some. Show some sneakers, young one. All right, he's just playing around. <laughs> I gave him a chance. <laughs> All right, y'all ready? Bang. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Christmas nines. Ooh, that yeah, those are sick. I don't have those, believe it or not. You don't have I them? You have I got everything, the bro. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But I don't got those. That's crazy. Yeah, you, you do have a lot of you may know me. You need to show history. off some stuff. Uh, we got a big Henry in the house. What up, bro? Chilling, chilling. You know, since nobody has shown one yet, and I just got my first one, you know. Oh, you got to the mic you. You, got you did? You know what I mean? Yeah, please do. Those came out dope. The notebook joints? Yes, yeah, sir. Nice. Those are dope. Those are fire. Give us a little review on them. I mean, what can I say? This is my this is my first time actually having like a safari print sneaker. And I will say this, the, the quality, it's good. Like, I mean, can't go wrong with it. I kind of took advantage before they take it away. I think there's like maybe I think at, by the end of this week, I think they're taking this um this selection out. So y'all yeah, go get, get it. On, get on it. Get on it. Bro, it's on and the thing is you're you you're paying 140 bucks for a, D, a a shoe that's made by you. Like you can't go wrong with it. Go go try to get a custom right now for 140 bucks. Let's do 100. You ain't getting no custom for 400 but I mean 140 bucks. No way. No way. Not at all. Then you know what I mean? Uh Not the only close. complaint I had, the only complaint is I wanted an icy white bottom, like you know, like the old school ones. The game of the blue, which is not fan, it still looks dope. But that icy white would have been dope because once it aged, it would have turned that nice yellow and it would have like popped a little more, but still really dope. And then you know, you know what? Why don't we do this? And I know I'm not really a high beat, but you uh -oh. know what you bringing out. But you know, why not? Oh, oh yeah, he's going five. Oh, okay. okay. You know, off white five. Showing off. I ain't mad at you. I mean, to be for me, I would prefer the black pair, but I got lucky with these, so why not? You, know? you want to cam up here? Show me some sneakers, and I'll let you cam yeah, up. Yeah. The crazy thing is, they they go all out, bro. Look at all these dang laces. Oh, it come with pink laces. It's red. Uh, red laces. Yeah. Oh, they're red. Okay. It's red. I'm color blind. <laughs> but it. it, it I, I get the concept. I see why people are. Okay, are here we go. Y'all want to show some sneakers? What you got? Show me some sneakers. Uh, I got. I only got one sneaker because I just got it. Okay, but what you got, man? Show them real quick. I know you okay. got to get up on here. What are those? They're, like, they're Jordan One Broken. Nice. I just got them at Southwell. Wait, is, that, is that the clay green? Cool. All right, bro. Thanks for coming in here, man. You're welcome. That was a fight. Look at the young ones, yo. Look at the young ones coming in here, yo. Yeah, you got to show off his kicks. I just, you know, sometimes we have the trolls in here to show, posting crazy images. Remember that one day? It was crazy. If you were in here. <laughs> I'm not trying to have any of that. Let me show off some kicks, too. Why not, right? I'll show some SBs. Oh, show the Kooji joints? Oh, yeah. All right. that's, the, that's the real nickname from the Coogees. Them people started mm -hmm. calling them the Huxtables. The Huxtables, yeah. I call them the Biggie Smalls. Mm -hmm. No doubt. These. Let me let me get some more stuff for you. We, I'm show a couple of dunks. The skunks. Okay. Of skunks. <laughs> I wish those were my size deals. You yeah, would get them. No, those, those are, not, those are in size nine, nine, right? I'm not taking any money for these. <laughs> Are those a size nine? <laughs> not for sale. <laughs> not those for just, sale. Those just show the down payment. Oh, oh my god, now down payment. Game over. Game over. It's, it's, it's over. Just end everything just, now, bro. Like, <laughs> you just show the down payment for a house right now, bro. You really, you really think it's fair for me to get into this battle this weekend? I mean, I'm going to win it. 
Well, I will tell you this. I will tell you this. You, in the battle, you can't show. You can't repeat sh shoes that you showed before. Everyone <laughs> can. Nobody can. Nobody <laughs> in the battle cannot show any shoes that they re showed before. So that's to be something. Your whole collection throughout all these battles. <laughs> nah. Well, see, no, no, no. For real. We, we showed collections afterwards, but the ones that you competed with, you can't show again. So. Wow. What yeah. what battle are y'all talking about? He want, he's having an all star battle. <laughs> you can't show any of the sneakers you've showed. I'm gonna take okay. notes, man. I'm Does telling you, this is and everyone else know this. Because I want you know you you know how my battles are. My battles, I like people to show something new that people haven't seen in a long time or probably never seen ever, and that's what I want people to come and see sneakers they probably never seen. Come on, let's be honest. How many people have seen this or know what this is, bro? You know what I mean? Doing, oh, that's a um, that's a ro that's a Ewing Rogue. Um, yeah. No, this is the Sport Light. Oh, that's right. That's right. Okay. Uh, this is a Sport Light. Like a Ewing, no. <laughs> it no, looks like a Rogue. I got some Ewing. I, I, I have the Rogues. The Rogues are. People don't know what the hell that sneaker. <laughs> no, they don't. And the thing is, it's crazy. Is this sneaker I wore? I find my, this is my first oh. one. Oh shoot, which one do you got? Yeah, I just got, I just got those, bro. Those are well, fly. Fresh kicks. You know how hard it is to find that sneaker right now? There's only in the U.S. There's only yeah. five for sale. There's only five for sale in the U.S. I got that pair. Wow. I want to say maybe three years ago, was it? Right off. Oh, yeah, the they released site. in 2016. They released in 2016. Yeah, I, I think it was three. Yeah, it was about three years ago. That's such you a dope piece, man. We, we good, brother. We good here, bro. Because you only got one shoe, but thank you for coming through. I'll see you backstage. Thank you, though, man. I mean, I'm a Ewing guy, so. Why not show another? My favorite of all time. Yeah, nice. That's a dope. That yeah. Purple City Bird game. The suede on it is crazy, yo. That Purple City Bird game. Hey, guys, I appreciate Dales. I appreciate you coming, uh, letting me come on. Appreciate you guys for showing off your dope collections or part of them. I need to roll. I need to charge my phone, go eat dinner, and all that good stuff. Y'all yeah, got to give it all my night. night. Well, what's the dinner, man? Spaghetti. Man, my man. wife makes a killer pot of spaghetti, so I'm <laughs> about to go smash. Oh, okay. Ooh, dang, that sounds good, yo. Yeah. All right, y'all. Right, Peace. All right, bro. All right. Yo, I regret selling all my dunks, but they weren't fitting, bro. There ain't no point of me keeping sneakers that don't fit, bro. Just because, yeah. you know. I like to wear my case, bro. Yo, I didn't sell many. I sold, I'll tell you, I know how many I sold. That's how that's how crazy it is. Because everyone I sold, I didn't want to get rid of. I got mm. here, I'll help you out. I, I see you're having a little bit of oh, there you go. See that. Um I I sold my um my skater dies, which I did Dang. not want to sell, but I, but I did because I wore them too much and they were looking like crap. So I was like, I'm not here. And then I sold my Mork and Mindy's because the same problem. They were looking like crap. The um, silver was getting scuffed up on it. It was looking, it was looking horrible. The, yeah, the you, fold on the toe was like crazy. Yeah, and, 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 and to restore that metallic silver is not easy. Yeah, it, it, it wasn't it wasn't a regular metallic, it was almost like a brush type of it's it's nuts. It's it's crazy. And I sold my um I sold my um he showed one of the pairs off that costume pack, the Thai Temples. Yeah. I said, shoot. Oh, boy. Y'all ain't ready. You are not ready. Mm -hmm. Mine's the keep. What's oh, going on? man. What's going on, gentlemen? What's going on? Oh, my God. I told you, surprise guests may be coming in What's tonight. Popping, it's popping, bro. <laughs> oh, up, man, bro? this is my first... Uh, I ain't really used to this, so I, I don't really. Hey, have to you could turn your phone the other way so we can get a wide screen. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, it's wild, man. Yeah, man, I I I ain't been avoiding you, man. I just <laughs> I no, I know, up. I know. This ain't your forte either, so you know. Right, you know, I'm just um, the whole pandemic stuff. I've been working from home. I just saw the the link. That's why I was like, man, I was trying to catch you. Well, I, I figured it'd be better if I just invited people spur of the moment because then I could get you if I could get you, you know. Well, 
Well, for me, it, it depends on it depends on what I'm trying to show you. <laughs> so, so uh, I show us some, some of your gems, bro. And you know what's funny? Because we're we're showing LeBrons. I've got two LeBrons that I got from you. <laughs> One of them Ak I Akron, Akron seven. Akron seven, I showed before, and and um and I got these, and I got this from him. See, oh yeah. Man. Yeah, and I still got them, and for the fan price too. Yeah, exactly. That's pretty he dope. Right over the head, and could have back then too. Right. Because I think this right. is even a sample, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, sir, it is. He, he, you know, and and it just shows I still have them. You know. Nah, yeah. that's pretty dope. Mm -hmm. And this, this was when this was ten years ago. Wow. At least. At least. Ten years ago, and I still got the shoe from my soul to keep. I even copped the T-shirt back then. Yeah, yeah, it, it, was, it was much appreciated. So, if you could show up some some gems that you think people would um love to see. See, but that's why I said it depends on when you catch me, because I got different stuff in different rooms. Yeah, yeah. So right now, I'm in a room that I don't think um. I don't think it's no LeBron samples in here. Oh, you don't got to show LeBron's if you got oh. some other stuff. Oh, oh, for sure. Yeah, we had someone come through, hit us with some SBs before. It's okay. like a free for all now. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I like that. I like that. You can go him, whatever you want to so, show. Because, I mean, it's funny. You have, you got different collectors who are into so many different, different things. And, and right now, it's, it's, Hype had a different meaning back then, you know, what yes. I mean, 10 years mm -hmm. ago. Now it's just nuts. Yeah. Um, so let me look, see. Is this a hyper dunk sample? Look at this. So I'm gonna just show you the heels first. Can you can you see the heels? Yeah, that urban prep. Urban prep. It's, 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 it's not too many of those that went around. And um, I happen to be uh, a friend of the person who designed them. Mm, let me go full screen. Yeah. So, and you know, everything I always, I always have everything in my size. I'm sorry, this is weird. I can't get used to these. Angles. Nah, it's all right. I'm trying to <laughs> figure it hey, out. Hey, listen, if you got a soda bottle or a sneaker, you could just rest your phone against it. Pause. Sure. That might work. Let me see. That's going on. Then you can't see. And you better. You need to um follow my soul to keep on Instagram. You want to see some sneaker treats? It's the got them. It's, it's the real the real my soul to keep. The real my soul to keep. Yeah, some uh some chump, some chump tried to grab my name back. <laughs> so, uh, 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 they asked me to buy it from him. I'm like, what? <laughs> must be crazy. Um, let me do this. I'm not gonna sit down. That happened to me. Someone got DJ Joe. I'm like, damn, bro. Really? Yeah. Wow. Okay. So, give me a second. Thank you, man. Some things like this. See, this was always my kind of thing. Mm. Like you see these Curry Dunk High, man. Mm. Yeah. Like, I remember being in Jersey City. And seeing this box on the floor, the, the size 13, 60 bucks. 60 and now, can you imagine if that came out now? Ridiculous on some hype beast. Hey, wait, hold on. You're size 13, bro? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I got a lot of things. I got a lot of things. Look, look, look at this. this the black print. The black it's all black. Oh man! Listen, I'm, I'm a sucker for all black sneakers, or like triple black, or uh, two thousand and three. Two thousand and three. Um, I know that light is killing me. I'm trying to. Um, Hold on, your IG is yeah. the real Marcel to keep. Yeah. yeah. Gotcha. Um, just see oh, damn. You, you, you don't know. <laughs> Yo, I'm looking right now at his IG, bro. It's no joke. 
Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you, you guys this. Chamber of, uh, Chamber of Fears, bro. Them Jones are fire. This was Powder Soul Grinch sample. Oh, damn. When Obi had the Grinch sixes, Powder Soul was in that Christmas game. Jesus. So, yes, it's, it's a sample. And, and somebody in the league is trying to get it from me. Yeah, I think I know what to do. No. He said no. You got, you got the, I know if, I, I, sorry for interrupting, but you got the sample of the J Pack of the, the Bronze Heavens? The, the J Pack. The Hero Pack? The Jordan one. Yeah, the Hero Pack. Yeah. Damn. I had the set. You have the whole this set. That's like kind of a grail of mine because it's two of my favorite players with together, bro. And he did the penny, which is another one yes. of my favorite players. Yeah. <sighs> like and it's, it's back back then. I'm telling you, it was a, it was a different time. So when I did get my hands on that, like, whoa. Yeah, me and Dells have talked about the hero pack a couple of times, bro. Mm -hmm. yeah. That should have retro. <laughs> um, what else? Some of my favorite things. Yo, you see, as soon as I seen his team, I thought I was like, yo, bro. Yeah, definitely go check his IG out, y'all. Definitely go check his IG. I'm definitely gonna go check it out right after this. Just, just, just make, just make sure you're wearing a bib or something, cause you're gonna be drooling. <laughs> I'm starting to kind of like, what? The oh, look at that! Wow, man, you talking <laughs> Air Force dude, Escape? Like my favorite shoes are not samples at all, and. Wow. Yo, I just, you, I just, is, is this an OG pair of the aerosols? Um, that's a retro. Okay. A retro from probably like 15 years ago. There's one aerosol I'm looking for, and I don't know if you remember. It had the elephant around it, but it was 3M. It's a black pair with gray with like a anthracite color. And I'm looking for because I had it, and I beat the crap out of it because yeah. I love it. They so retro, comfortable and it was a retro, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Retro, I don't I can't find one. another pair. No, I no, think I, I got I know I got some of the white and I think uh and anybody wants to know what I'm talking about, that's yes. the sneaker yes. talking about. Yes. yes, so I got a white and red pair, white and green pair. Um what else, man? I'm like oh, I'm, old I'm an old school basketball fanatic and I, so am I, 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 I am not a Nike head. No, sir. Hey. Hey. I can tell. You got the bubble chucks. I mean, huh? You got hand ones? Yeah. 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 Bro. My guy had me plays for him. Well, played for him one back in the day. So, you know, uh, that, that's one of my, my, my day one guys. So, we talk, well, we talk all the time. Um. What else? Yeah, you're, you're you're my size, so I would never trust me to go to your house. <laughs> you might be losing, you might be missing something because you know. So. That's okay. You have a long time <laughs> <in> now. <laughs> Good guy, yo. But uh, so it's funny. I had came down to Texas to do kickball one time, and. Um, Kid comes up to me at my table and he said, Here, I want to give you this. And it was before Under Armour blew up. It was a UT sample. Oh, wow. Wow. And I kept on grabbing and everything. Hey, I'm not that far from their headquarters. Yeah. So, I mean, so I've had this. Sitting there for like probably ten years, but that, that, that show, man, I, I I I kept a lot of things. I, I was never into the just 
catch and release. Like somebody's stupid. It seems like they're going fishing. So, um, what else we got in here? Uh, I know you guys recognize unions. And this was a big back there with the insole. Yeah, the lining is sick on those. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, these are. That was, that was before the big hype on them. Uh huh. Yeah. And I just had somebody from the UK ask me. I'm like, dude, I wasn't telling you these. Stop looking around at everything else. Like, yo, what about all yeah, because that's the thing. If, so, if people start finding out that that's a union, it's over. Right. You 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 won't find that for the price that you can find it now. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it's like, and sometimes people don't know what they have in their own closets. No, that's true. This ain't really a big deal, but these air pythons and this iridescent. Yeah, that iridescent looks different. Yeah, that's that big wave. Ooh. Those are fire. Fish no, I mean the color is it yeah. kind of remind me of it. Yeah. But it got that fish skill, yeah. Yeah, these are man. Again, I, I always bought what I like. It was never about hype or you know being popular. I, I just I just had to love for nah, sure. Nah, that's what it's about. You're supposed yeah. to buy what you like, yeah. right? Yeah, but they these these kids don't get that. Um what else? I'm, I'm the, the 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 phone is actually on a stack of boxes, man. Um, yo, they had a nice run, a few, like what six years ago with them pythons. They released a lot of them pythons, and then and then um, mm -hmm. that was it. I remember yeah. they had a little run. They came out with the old black yeah. one. They need to bring them back. I got a um, I got a pair that they did specifically for Twenty One Mercer. That one was called Twenty One Mercer. It's like all orange, 3M. The whole thing is 3M. It's not in this room, though. It's upstairs. So, yeah, I'm going to keep doing that. I'm going to hit you with that link in the DM and yeah. go around in a different room, you know, come through. Uh, yeah, that, that'll that be a part of it. See, it's easy. You can just use your phone and, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, I feel like you got to know people know about your collection, too, man. I mean, I know you may not care about that, but I, I like to see. Have you showcased you know? Yeah, I just, yeah, I, just man, I, I didn't really cared for, for the fame, you know. I know. Yeah, I know. But for me, I like, I like to yeah. see stuff. Yeah. Because, you, know, you know, I did those soul competitions, you know, the Kexmo expeditions, and um, it was fun. Like, I just see. Oh. see, see. <laughs> No, what I'm telling you, this guy is not one. This guy Are got you serious? <laughs> in a size 13. Yeah. Not the size 13. That's 14. crazy. The guy's got a shoe collection. That's a size 13. Stuff. It's yeah. not done that. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. wow. Yeah. As I said, look, wow. I got this from this man 10 plus years ago. Nah, mm -hmm. that's, that's dope, though. That's fire. Look, I'm saying, like, to find that Stewie in a size 13 is ridiculous. They're going crazy over uh, over dunks now. Oh, you got, a, you got a lot of dunks. Come on, man. Like, I can go all the way, almost 20 years. <laughs> you remember when they used to call him the poor man's Air Force One, bro? Uh-huh. Sure did. And hey, what they say? Dunks are for pump. <laughs> yeah, they used, they used to clown me and in high school. Jordan. They used to clown me because I used to love instead of because the Air Force One was for some reason not as comfortable as them. And I used to love getting the white on white dunk lows every summer. That was my sneaker to get, and it was so cheap. And it just looked dope. The more they got beat up, it looked dope. And bro, I just oh man, and people used to be like, "Oh, get yourself some Air Force." I'm like, "Nah, bro, trust me." I'm good with these. Ooh. 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 Uh, I got Terminator still. I don't. I hey, that, that's the Hoya one? Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, there's oh. only one guy I know right now that has another the, the Hoya ones, and that's Throwback King. Shout out to Throwback King. Man. 
and my joints. <laughs> that's you. But see, I'm in I'm in Maryland, so that shoe did not last here. Like people bought them like crazy, you know. There's a lot of alumni here from Georgetown, so wow. I'm thinking, yeah. yeah, so you know, when I walk the street, I, I wear these and you know, I you, you get the what are those, but they really don't know what are those. <laughs> they they clown it, but they don't understand, you know. I don't want to wear your sock liner looking easy shoe. I, that's just not my thing. You know? <laughs> 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 well, you talking about the 350? <laughs> I, I don't buy, other than the Nike pairs that released, I have never purchased a Yeezy shoe. You know what? Me and you could become very good friends, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best silver weather than Yeezy to me. Those are real Yeezys right there. Better than the one. <laughs> Uh, I see. I'm biased about the one. I just love the one. The one is the one. Dope. Yeah, like the, the two. The two was like him doing something completely different because you've never seen that back of the mm -hmm. two in What's any it? sneaker. Never. Yeah, doing something different. Yeah. Like you see these guys, they release the new sneaker or one, two, three. They all look kind of similar. He went somewhere else with the two. Mm -hmm. I wish that thing worked out with Nike. I, I would have preferred. Nike versus yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, you, was... you never know with it with Nike because they've been popping up a lot of these Yeezy showing. Mm -hmm. Is that the Air Revolution? That's my Ooh. favorite shoe of all time. Just to let y'all know, the three had that bottom. So I mean the Air Revolution had that bottom so before the three. Yep. Absolutely. Absolutely yep. correct. They were going to call the Jordan the Air Jordan Revolution, actually. And when I tell you, I got about 15 dead stock pairs. What? It's not a game. How much, bro? I need one. We He's talk. not playing. <laughs> He's definitely not playing. You know what I'm This man also got stock. I have one pair of Air Revolution. No I, I have one pair of Air Revolution. I have one pair of Air Revolution. Yeah, there they go. <laughs> no, nah, I like the red ones though. But the blue ones are the blue ones here too. The blue one's fire. Bro. I think all of them are fire, bro. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. I've oh, yeah. shown you too many Nikes. Okay. Oh, oh damn. damn. Victory. Woo. <laughs> That's crazy. That's a tennis pair. That's a tennis pair. Yes, sir. Michael Yes, sir. Court victory. Yo, Dallas, I gotta get up out of here, bro. It's all right, bro. Thank you for coming by, man. Thank you for having me, bro. I Yo, like I got his link in the description. Follow him, and I'll throw everyone else's, man. Appreciate but, um, yeah. it, Salute. Say it. You ready? Yeah, man. I see my first pair of pennies up there in the corner. It's up by the ceiling, though. <laughs> yeah, like, don't worry about it on this trip. Flight 89s. Not these retro pairs that just came out, neither. No, it's it's the, the, old, the old ones. are Even the older retros are better than what's releasing now. Like, material-wise. They dropped the seventy six to one, and I heard it that the leather on that is not nice. Well, I mean, and it's it's what steers me away from buying a lot of stuff now, man. Um, yeah. But like the 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 whole retro concept was the gift and the curse because mm -hmm. that killed a lot of the oh I have these and y'all don't. When they start yeah. retro pairs, they never been retro. So, I'll give you that. Like one shoe that I that I finally got in my hand. Did they do the retro this again? Which one? Yeah, they just retro that one. They just retro. And bro, it's so like crazy. Same, right? Uh, nah, nah. And the thing is, the fit ain't the same. The OG ones were right. true to size. The the new ones aren't true to size. No, they run small. Um, 
Yeah. Oh, okay. That's, that's enough. And the re the resale on them are stupid. They're three hundred fifty bucks, bro. The resale on them right now. Nah. Um, what, what, what? Why is such a big hype for these now? You know what I mean? Like, dang, people wanted them now. Like, I couldn't have a pair back then because um, I bought a size thirteen, and bro, that hurt my feet so much. I had to get a four. Try to get a fourteen, but they were all sold out because. Stores only get like one size fourteen, and if you don't get it, then it's done. Good luck finding a size fourteen. So that's I'm the size fourteen kid. Me. Uh, I don't know why. Yeah. Huh? I don't know what the hype is for the Barbies. I have no idea. The black one sold out too. The black one has a a resale. Um, and oh, oh, oh look right there. I don't know what they're gonna do with the pennies. Hopefully, the penny threes don't have no crazy. What's he got there? Oh yeah! Ooh. Come on, guys! The leather on this is so soft. That's an eighty-nine pair. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. And it's still holding up, man. Yes, sir. Wow. Oh. The paint thing. Oh, good money. All my stuff has been kept in climate controlled areas. Okay. Yes. All of it. So when somebody decided they want to buy a collection, because I'm getting old. <laughs> you never know. I wanted I was looking for some detail. I even had sample slides. Yo, what's that hat? You see the king. Oh, you yeah, know, yeah. King These are samples. Oh, I remember. That's for the LeBron 9. Not this color. No, 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 no. But I remember when they tried to bring that one for the LeBron 9. Yeah. Hey, so I remember. Comfortable, too. I remember the South Beach one. Remember how popular yeah. the South Beach one? Yeah. Like, yeah. heads were buying those and flipping them like crazy back then. What else I got? That's crazy. That brought me back, man. I remember how many people were re trying to resell them things or were reselling those. The, yep. the South Beach Chinquetas. The soldier. That's a soldier before the soldier. Yeah, so, the 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 uh twenty five five. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. all them perforations on there. So crazy, yo! It's a thing of beauty. Those are sick. Is that the Ohio P E or something? I don't know. You think Ohio P E? Um, I, I know they, they released to the general public. So, um. um I know I'll have a couple. That a lot of East Bay colors too. Like East Bay exclusives. Yeah, LeBron had a bunch of East Bay exclusives back in the days. A lot of, a lot of basketball. The 70 had the blue one and the orange one. Gray and orange. Blue. I got gray and orange You gotta go back to that major, the Air Force. This was made out of stingray. Damn. So, and it came with this bag of places. The soul is that inside out. Jeez. They only they had these had had the 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 only, the only, only place that I've ever got them. And I got and another pair that's the sample that has the hair all, all around the whole thing instead of the leather. Same exact show, same show, show but what the hair goes. These are the these gems. The this leather this is amazing. amazing. Like, they but don't do it. What you did, man? 
Okay, I got to come to the window some love. I know Dell's been trying to take it for a minute. <laughs> See why, though? That's fact. Yo, you don't understand. I got a lot of things. I mean, I just like, like, I didn't even go half of his his pictures on IG, bro. Like, wow. Yeah, so a little bit of a bit of a joke. Um, it's funny because I was looking at those, those Barclays, right? Like I just showed you. And I have a pair, instead of it being purple, it's royal blue. Yeah. So, um, if I'm not wrong, there was some pairs that had that uh, purple bluish color instead of the like actual purple, and I forgot why that happened. Yeah, it's yeah. it supposed to be the purple for like the Phoenix, mm -hmm. um, but for some reason, some of them came out like that. I forgot what you, what, when that happened, but same like with the white ones that are coming out recently, they're mm -hmm. doing that purple bluish color instead of the purple, um, yeah, yeah. which is the actual. <laughs> color so right. I don't know, man. We'll see how how that one's gonna go with because that white pair thing is gonna go fast too, just like the other one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like people are buying them like left and right. I don't know why. I don't know if it's like people actually buying them to keep or are they doing it for resale? I don't know. Yeah, but uh, I'm a big man, Barclay fan. The game like my game. one of my favorite Nike ones is the Godzillas. I love the Godzillas, bro. Yeah. They need to bring back the house of hoop one, the tweet one, the the bread one. Bring that whole uh, what was it? I think two thousand seven release. The, all those uh, releases they did it. Those were fire. I would like, I would to like some other brands. You know, like I think I think New Balance, New Balance basketball should should go the red for a little bit. Um, because there were so many like. He bought basketball back in the 80s, man. There was so many different joints. Like, that whole um, transport line. Like, Sockety or spot built back then. You know? it's, it's a lot of that can be done. But I, I feel that everybody is trying to have that. that oh, it's the kind of pairs. It's going to sell out of the half pants. Like that, that ain't okay, no man. This used to be fun. Obtaining the shoe after back to back. And, yeah, and, and and that's when um when I started getting into the feline stuff, it brought me back to nostalgia. Uh, same thing with Reebok. When I when they started releasing all the pumps again, I was so happy. I got burnt. Yeah. You know the Twilight. Well, with Reebok, they just went too crazy with something. With that last yeah, yeah. crazy one they got. Like when Swiss was around, they started putting out good colorways. Like, well, yeah, yeah, they started. Yeah, but that's when, that's when the took over. Mm -hmm. So I think that influence came from the three stripes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But then they was rocking. Like, True. Yeah. But you know, I mean, look at look look at now. I think in, in October, Reebok had such a toe. Oh my god, one of the best. Like overall presentation of, of releases, like between even the OG retro of the Kemp, like the whole presentation, the the the, the drawer box mm -hmm. and the materials, they went all loud on the materials and actually made it almost close to the OG as they could. And even with the black and white pair, the East Bay color, where they released um like a like a I think what was it a month or two before that. It went all out with that one, bro. Reebok can do it. Um, Book the shot just sold out very quick, too. Oh my god, that, that don't even last. No, but even both times when they first retro the shack notes is the OG colorway, that sold out super fast, and so did this one. Mm -hmm. Um, and now they're doing the reverse, which supposedly was supposed to come out sometime this month. I don't know, I haven't heard anything yet, but the reverse uh colorway of the OG. It's supposed to release, and since I didn't get the OG, hopefully I can get down. Of which one? The Shack Gnosis. Oh, the Shack. See, I, my favorite was the Shack Attack. The oh, Shack yeah. Attack. But that one, too. The OG colorway of that one sells out so fast Yeah. that it's like, what the heck? Yo, you blink, and it's gone. Like, no oh, joke. Okay. And a lot of people are 
You know, I think that, oh, you know, Jordan 1 sell out. Yeah, Jordan 1 sell out super quick. Yeah, don't get me wrong. So do these, you know? Yeah. yeah. These, yeah. It's, it's crazy, man. Yeah. But, and, but the, the difference is they don't they make, make as many pairs of the stuff that do the, of the Jordans. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, and what's happening with the apps is, and we're talking about these restocks, I think it's not selling them all in the clips. It's not selling them all in the clips. So it's no restock. They're holding them all in the clips. They, this is, a, this is a funny thing, and, and I heard this from a couple of representatives or ex representatives of Nike. Um, they did like you said, they hold them back. Not only do they hold backups for some so called restocks, also they hold back because of, uh, in, you know, just in case this company's about to over, open a new store, they can yeah. fill them up with the, with the yeah, with those the, grand openings, yeah. like yeah. Those yeah. jazz with them crazy, yeah. Grand so Shoes and what that. I hear, like they hold about thirty percent of the stock for those type of things. So right. imagine right. we're not getting everything, everything. Mm -hmm. So, right. and then afterwards, if those stores don't open, they still have those backed up pairs. So that's when the so-called restocks start right. popping right. again. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. But <laughs> it's crazy, bro. It's it's. We'll see. Like you said, there's a lot of brands that I would love for them. Like I know, um, LA Gear try to come back and they try to bring the uh, the uh, Kareem Abdul Jabbar, but they didn't. Uh, they didn't do too well. They sold, but they didn't do too well. Yeah, um, they the to do that. Yeah, they. Yeah, um, I, I they were selling it, and I didn't know it was too late. By the time I noticed, they didn't have my size. They, they were part. They partnered also with uh with Urban Outfitter. Open Urban Outfitter was selling them for, and I didn't know that. And they had the OG white and black colorway, which is one of my favorite ones. Mm -hmm. Um, then uh, British Knight do try to do the same thing, and they brought back some of their uh, older models, but they were upcharging, bro. They were charging 250 bucks a piece for British Knight. Nah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. So, so they're tripping with that, trying to come back. Okay, fine, y'all put good leather in it. But so do the all these other brands do the same thing. They don't charge two hundred fifty bucks. I never, I never wore British Knights as a kid, like so. I got no connection. I, 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 I had the, I had the actual shoes, not the sneakers. Okay, oh, no, I, had the, I, had the I never had the, the sneakers. Um, that that was that was a long too late for me. Because <laughs> you didn't you didn't see nobody in the NBA in the eighties wearing British Knights. Nah, that is true. it was more of a streetwear. It was more of a streetwear brand, you know. Yeah. So, it was MC Hammer. Yeah, MC Hammer was heavy on the British. The, the only thing is, yeah, troops. Um, troops is still out. Troops still has their stuff out there. Um, they they're still doing their little thing. Um, a lot of these brands are out there. Y'all just gotta look. They have their own websites. Um. Yeah, you know what I, I like what um I like what the Ewan brand is doing with those like um collaborations with the oh, like, 90s crazy. album covers. Like so they, they just made one that was the colorway of the main source yeah, Adams joint. Like, those are fire. Like, and they they go Onyx did a one on two. Mm -hmm. so, um, is this guy got a stick, um, um, collection of Ewings, by the way. This dude, Henry, here, yeah, he got a lot of Ewings, bro. yeah, like a lot of them. Uh, I, got a lot. <laughs> I got a lot. I got, I got hooked. I see, I remember the sneaker, but I'm from, I'm from the DMV area, so. Okay. I mean, you'll see them here, here and there, especially from a lot of New Yorkers that would come down, move from you know New York down here. They'll mm -hmm. bring them with them, but we didn't, you know, there weren't stores that would really um, have them. Then, then when they retro them again in 2012, luckily I was back here in a DMV because uh, I moved back from Florida to the DMV. Um, I started seeing that, you know, I saw Dells having them, Fomer, uh, and then Throwbacking, but throw me and Throwbacking. Um, we were talking because of the whole feline thing, which is funny and Reebok stuff. Uh, no Nike Jordan stuff, it was always about um, the feline Reebok, like them bringing them back. They need to bring this back, blah, blah, blah. And he was like, Yo, have you ever tried a pair of Ewings? And I'm like, No, I've seen Dells, I've seen you, I've seen Fomer, and a couple other guys have them. He's like, Bro, go get yourself a pair. 
I was mm-hmm. contemplating. Then I finally just said, whatever. I was a DTLR. They finally had the purple ones. I really like the purple ones. Grab the purple ones. And from there it started. And now I have like about 40 pairs of just Ewing 33 highs. Nice. Nice. (laughs) I mean, that's literally my fall to spring sneaker is the Ewing 33 high. Okay. Um, Oh, he's looking for more sneakers. Okay. Yeah, I'm just. I love this shoe. Mm Mm-hmm. This is a uh, patent leather forum boat. Adidas. Another, another Right? It's a nylon in the blue. Yeah, like mesh in the blue piece. Like, man. I think I think that the form, the altitude, the rivalry, they don't get the credit that they deserve. Right. Or the time. Top no way. Like I used to, I used to love the form and the altitude for like three years. And I was in high school. That was one of the pairs I would go get because it was nobody was getting them. So I was like, nah, I'm. A, they they were comfortable. They looked dope. Um, and bro, and they always would put them. Y'all remember that sell that was like two for sixty nine ninety nine. Yeah, two back for in the day, that's what my bro, I was yeah. Kid, I so I took the, the time. Yeah, I would take advantage. I'll get a shell toe. And I would get that one if I want my Adidas Crave. And if I didn't want my Adidas Crave, I'd go to Saucony sometimes with New Balance. Then I would go, um, and then, you know, obviously Reebok over here. Reebok was pretty big, especially for the men, the white and gray uh, Reebok. Yo, it's just crazy in the state. What it's like now, it's like people are so crazy about Yeezy, but you don't see them crazy about Adidas. Like, all these hype beasts, like it just shows that it's this guy creeping. Ooh. <laughs> this is a black history month sample. Damn. Okay. Bro, so I was at Cleveland. I was in Cleveland for the Cleveland Got Soul event. And is that wood green? It's a wood grain 3M. Yeah, that's that reflective, like kind of like a rod, like the rod and the Kobe's and all them. Uh-huh. That's the, yeah. So when I, when I tell you, a friend of mine from Chicago who was out there, and it, it's the BHM logo. Yes, it. He brings these over to me, and it's like, yo, here. Damn. My guy Jose from Chicago. Bless me with this size 14 because he wears like a nine and knew that he yeah. didn't do much with it. But I mean, that's that's the kind of thing it was like back then. Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's with, different now. It's, it's so different. So, this is, the 14 so it on my soul, this is what I was trying to tell some people because people are have that that whole thing that there's only samples in the site. Size nine or, or no, ten, no. and I'm like, no, those are the main main samples. The ones that are going to be like GRs or like big releases are in that size. But there's samples out there that are in multiple sizes. It's just, you know, you got to find them. They're hard. Well, they you make know? samples out of the nine for people to wear. Like, what they're going to see out like early? Yeah. They got samples. You know what I mean? I have had samples in every size from a six to an eighteen. Exactly. Every and that's what I tell them. So the half sizes and everything. So it's all about whoever is in production, what they want yeah. to run. Nike's not gonna just go and run one one shoe. It doesn't happen that way. So it's whether they if they run a size run, they might just let the nine and thirteen out. Yeah, you know, it doesn't the thing mean, is, you know, friends and family that get the other things. <laughs> yeah, no, the thing is, a lot of people don't understand it. Like, yeah. let's say, um, so and so, this player is rocking, let's say, the Hyper Dunk 2012, right? Whatever, mm-hmm. and they want to bring out a sample. They're not going to bring him a size nine. No, they're going to bring him his right. size right. to see yeah. how it'll look on his size. And that way he can see if it, you know he likes it. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. that's what I'm talking. Like I was telling a lot of people, like y'all, there's there's samples out there in sizes, all different sizes. I've 
had one in hand and was about one. But the samples can be expensive. People be yeah. be taking on samples. So. Well, 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 that happens. That happens when people start flipping. You know, yeah. when, when it comes from the right source, it's it's not expensive at that point. But then yeah. that person takes it, flips it, and they put yeah. it from money back, and they flip it, and yeah. it becomes ugly. And then you have uh, a lot of uh, in players in the leagues who want to come <laughs> and buy. Uh, Buy up collections that they never <laughs> had before. You know, like, yeah. it wasn't their time. Like, so they now they don't have a choice but to deal with certain people because only certain people have this kind of stuff. You know, but um, like I said, I, I, I this the whole and it's not shout out the nice case in Austin. Um. It's been a long time since you can go into a tour not looking for, with no expectations, and find something on the wall. Like, oh, oh, I'm, I'm, let me get those. And it's not the hype release that just released last week. Yeah. You know, and the last few times I've been down there, man, I was able to pick up some some gems and put low, too. Like, oh, 50 bucks, 40 bucks. Like, you know, that's the unheard of. It's been like it's been a while since you since you hear that. To be honest with yeah, you, yeah, that's, that's real talk, man. He, yeah. he used to be able to go hunt for, for them kind of the yes. books, you know. Yeah, I, that, that that's one thing I loved about when I was living in, in Orlando and not you know working at the outlets. It was so dope because right after work or during break, go hit the factory store and see what's going on there, bro. I got mm -hmm. Jordan. 21s at one time for 40 bucks. I got in the 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 black toes there one day. They were sitting, they they broke the pack up and they were sitting there and I got them for 35 bucks, bro. Oh, and and bro, it was so dope back then. I mean, now it's a little harder cuz you get the people that line up at freaking what? 5 in the morning to try to get into the factory and Wipe it but, out before anybody. But the thing that got the people in the factory being chased, they already know what it is. So yeah. if, if they see all the old Jordan 3 and 14, they're going to hide it all the side so they can leave. Yep. You know, you know that, that, that's what they've done now. I remember that. anything over the you got an additional discount. Yeah, I loved it, bro. Man. I used to get to, but I those tight old good sales sneakers for twenty dollars. Yeah, yeah. fifteen twenty bucks. I was like, bro, I got a. Um, I still remember the day I got a pair of up tempos for only what was it? Well, with taxes, I paid twenty two and change, bro. With taxes, wow. up See, tempo. Now you go buy a pair of retros and come out to two, two twenty four ninety eight, and you like, that. And like it, <laughs> you don't feel good about the purchase no more. Back then you went on, I came up like I I I, I remember again. Shout out to Tom Dick and Harry in, in Harlem. I, I will never forget getting a pair of black and red Jordan one size thirteen for thirty dollars because it was the last shoe. And they, they put it down back then. They used to put the last shoe on. See, you, know, you can tell, you can tell that you, you're OG because you didn't say bread, bro. You said black. Nah, and red. nah I don't. And, and it, it's just like some of these cats. I try to tell them, like, listen, when they keep calling the, the one thing that irks me a little is when they call the charcoal sevens, they call them the Raptors. And I'm like, no. The Raptor Sevens are the ones that came in that DMP pack. The Raptor, the charcoal. Oh, see if you can lower the volume a little bit. You're getting a lot of echo. If, if you don't mind, and you can just hit the volume, the, the your volume down maybe a little on your phone. Mine. Yeah, if you could just hit it down a notch or two, maybe it'll fix the echo. Yeah, that's a good problem. How is it? Yeah, you bet way better. Okay, it was all the way up. Yeah. I we should have told you that earlier. <laughs> it's better now than never, right? It's all good, man. But yeah, no. Nah. It's, it's, it's tough to um, 
even have these conversations with with anybody who who wasn't there because yeah. it's almost like like you had to be there i was, I was talking was talking about talking to somebody about back in back in harlem we had a strip on third avenue where it was just all sneaker stores you know some were owned by koreans some were owned by you know the the latinos in spanish harlem but you could always go in there like we would just go to look let's see what's there you know let's go see what's there so you know we would go check things out and like i said man you you could leave with something every time or you could be like you know what i'm gonna come back for these next week and they would still be there they would still be there that that's how it was for me i'll go over to like fordham road go to like um you know all the spots over there you know what i mean and, and now you, you don't got all that even the gear like you go to um sammy's fashion in the bronx on yeah. fordham you know, you go to um, what was the spot upstairs of um, um, Music Factory by the Burger King? I forgot what that was. Um, what the hell was that store called? Damn, I forgot. But there were so many stores on Florida Road, man. We yeah, walk up and down. They, if they had them, you know, you'd come back next week. Now, now it's like if you walk into the store and they even have a shoe that you want to buy, it's like it's shocking. Yeah, and and it's going to be full price, even though it's the last one on the display. Yeah, display too. They they don't give it damn. That game, you know, for, dust on it and all. <laughs> yeah, for whoever has a, a, a athlete's foot around them, because there are still some around there. Yeah. Around, they got they got a good store, man. Always look there. To um, I have a friend of mine who has one near him. They still oh, they still go the way they did. They do. That their shoe has been there for over a week. They start dropping the price already. And yeah. they don't try to keep that price for like to the end of the year. Nah, they do it. They yeah. still kind of doing it like how it was back then. That if that shoe sat there for a week, they already drop it like twenty dollars on the retail. Right. And like it starts, Models. Remember Models back in the yeah. day? Yeah. The Models. All the Yo, Models are gone here, bro. It so. was a Models on and on Fordham Road. It's it was on Fordham Road, and we were we was we was really young, and we would take the train from from um, Harlem over to Fordham Road. And one day, we went in the Models, and the Models had grape fives on the table. Now, the table back in the day was a huge table of sneakers that they tied together by the laces, and they was for sale just like that. Nobody, yeah, yeah. Bro, it was like 70 pairs of great fives on the table for $29. Crazy. Because again, nobody cared. We Shoes were, were sitting them. during those times too, man. <laughs> green bean right. fives around that time, green bean fives. I remember I used to go to like BX Sports. I'd see them just yeah. sitting there. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. It's it's like I said, it's different. Shoe shop. Remember, they were sitting. Toro Pimes. Yeah. Remember the Toro Pack? Mm-hmm. Them things yeah. were sitting. Now people are a lot of a heart attack if they get their Do, hands do you know what's them. crazy? Before they're going to start sending the pairs back Dr. to Nike. Dr. J's. That's the store. Thank you, Frankie. Yeah, Doc, Oh, Dr. J's. They're still around. Um, yeah, I used to love that store. That used to be the best. That's where Brother, the thing old. is. I used that to buy so many shoes at that Dr. J's. That, ra- that raging bull, right, the raging bull pack. Yeah, yeah. Wait, hold on one second. Hold, hold on one second, Henry. You had to go up the escalator, right? Yeah, you you, walk, you walk through that little glass hallway, and then they had two escalators. You go yeah. up. I'm getting goosebumps talking about that. Yeah. Stuff. And then you walk the, all the way to the back. That's when they the had the one on 125th. So mm-hmm. we didn't even always have to go over to the Bronx, but that yeah. was their table, they will always have air flights, Nike flights, and Air Force Ones. So I used to always get pairs of Air Force Ones for $29.99 off those tables. Yeah. Oh, those man. were the days, bro. I used to I used to go to Fordham. I what I would do is I'd go to this place, Music Factory. It was right by the jewelry store. There was a jewelry store. You go to the record store downstairs in the basement. And then after that, I'd probably go to, sometimes I'd go to Burger King, which was right next door. And uh-huh. then there was the Dr. J's above that, man. Crazy throwback right there. I love it. Yeah. Henry, go ahead, bro. No, I was just saying, like, it, it, it's nuts because to remember that a lot of these pairs, you know, the nowadays people 
are are thirsting over man, like you said, they just like that that raging bull pack was one that I kicked myself. I was friends with this dude at Foot Action, and he in Orlando still remember, uh, and he was gonna sell me each pack for 150 bucks if I wanted them. He's like, yo, nobody's buying them, bro. Can you get them? And nobody was buying them because they didn't like the 3M, the 3M five. They only mm. wanted the red one. The, the, Some the, people the didn't sweat. like the red either, man. They were saying it's yeah, a little much so, back then. And so I, I, I was, and then a lot I of bought, people were trying to get a them. lot of people. The day they came out. Yeah, a lot of people were trying to get the 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 countdown pack, and instead of that, and even some of the countdown packs sat for the two, the two and the nineteen. I mean, the two and the uh, twenty one. Them things sat for forever. They yeah, were and the one. For, they were on sale for like a. I've seen them for like a hundred and seventy five dollars at a foot at foot. I saw I saw the one with the twenty two at the factory store when I was in Orlando at the outlet for a hundred and twenty five dollars. Wow, both pack the pack. They weren't even trying to be like, "Oh, we're gonna split it." No, they're like, "Yo," and the dude, the <laughs> he's whole like, pack. "Can I be one hundred with you?" We got over two hundred p- packs in the back. That's why they're this price. And then at one time, I was about to get. I was. I wanted one, but they didn't have my size. And, bro, like they put them down for the uh, what was it one twenty five plus the twenty. Or whatever for the hat, the back wall, or whatever. Yeah, that back wall was a was a nice one. What you looking oh, for? I see your eyes moving, my soul. I see your neck turning with that kick. Yeah, I'm just, you know, I'm just browsing the room. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, it's a lot of uh, everything brings back some sort of memory, man. Well, that, that was the thing that got me into sneakers so heavy. Is like when I started being able to earn more money, I was able to buy more and more sneakers. And, and like, you know, they just would give me vibes, you know, different vibes. Yeah. It's kind yeah. of like music, you know, when I listen to music. But when right. I see a sneaker, I wear a sneaker, it, it, it brings back stuff, you know. Yeah, man. And talking about it too, like right now, I, I love this, you know. Yeah, see, and 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 this this is these are the conversations that this generation will never have. Like nah. they will never know what it was like to go hunt. Oh, I had a buy. I hit on the app. Like yeah, that, that that's that's their hunt, mm-hmm. and that is no hunt. Like really, nah. it's the it's the luck of the draw when you think of it like that, or you got somebody who's backdooring stuff. All they so want the internet is basically ruined the game if you really think about nice. it. Nice. This is all they want is these right here. That's all you want? That's all <laughs> they want. They just want to talk about these. Oh, that's all they want, right. Right. Yeah. Right. You know, um But you see the, the, a lot of people look at that look at show that sneaker one more time, please. A lot of people don't look at that as a sneaker. They look at it as money, a payday. Yeah, and that's all they I, look at it as. Mm-hmm. That's why nobody. I'm gonna lie. Wears I see this yep. one when I got this pair. I was like, at first, I was like, let me scope it out, see, you know. I do like the black pair, mm-hmm. um, because I see it as more as an art piece. Like if you look at the sneaker, it's crazy the details and the things. I see where he was going, um, but no, I ain't gonna lie to you. Now that I see it, I'm like, yo, dude, since these kids are so hyped and they want to pay that big money for it, okay. But you know what? This is for me to go get something else that I really want. You know what I mean? Right. And that right. I've been looking for. Um, right. But like some of those revolutions. Which is dope. <laughs> <laughs> he, got, he got about two dozen for you, Henry. <laughs> uh, no, no, but these are, you know, it's crazy, though. That since I've gotten these, bro, I've gotten so many people hit me up, but they are kind of cool. They already called for, which is crazy. Um. Oh. And I'm gonna get something I want out of it, so which is good. Good, but man. um, that's what it's about. Yeah, I mean, oh, you man. know, you gotta you gotta trade around sometimes too. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 definitely. Oh. Definitely. Yeah, yeah I, I I made a lot of collectors' collections great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know you that, did. That, that I know you know. did. <laughs> like, I made a lot of collectors' collections great. But um, it's been a long time, man. You guys don't understand, man. Yeah, ten years ago, bro. Yep. 
Yeah. And just think, I've been on YouTube for all this time. No break. <laughs> wow. Like, yeah, hell, even I had to take a break of some years back, man. Mm -hmm. Um, but and that was around the time that the air pressure re-released, and I missed it. Oh, the air pressure. Yeah, I have my chair. I, I got the uh, guy, the, the guy that we were talking about throwback. You, you know what? We gotta have throwback king one day. Us four is sitting in here and talk. Because throwback king has two pairs of the air pressure. Oh man, and and I will straight up rock them. There's no. Bro, you there. know when they hit the outlet? When they hit the outlet, unfortunately, they didn't have our size. No joke. Right. My was, like, I went was everywhere and checked. Marshall, they didn't have our size. Fifty dollars. Yeah. I was like, what? One shoe that I was crazy. happy. Marshall, one shoe that I was happy they rented was this one. Stop playing, Marshall. I hate those shoes. You hate these? I hate them. Bro. Oh, no, I love you, you my boy. Boy. I, well, hate I love them the all the time. All of them? <laughs> all of them. Oh, man, this yeah. is my baby. Bro. I, I love this one. So, look, this, I don't know if it's coming out. I saw recently the one the one pair that I might like is a it's a royal blue one. With oh, yeah, with the blue. And, yeah. and black and white. Supposedly set to release either Late December, early January. They don't know yet, hundred percent. Because the thing is crazy. That, I don't like the Supreme. None of them. I hate well, them. I wanted the original <laughs> one of these. They messed up this release. Was the that the Japan joint? That was originally the Japan exclusive. No. Or yeah. Yeah. And okay. then it's supposed to have an all quilted inside, like a corduroy inside, and they didn't bring it out there. Nah, they could give you that. They OG, which is probably yeah. falling apart now. But the OGs like falling apart. I found them a couple pairs, but they're all falling apart. Nobody took care of them. It's, it's... You, don't, you don't get down with the phones either, right, my soul? Or you get down with the phone posits? Oh, you bugging. Ah, uh, here we go. He's a, he, I knew it. There's no way. I mean, he said he's New York, bro. New York is a... Uh... Oh, the uh, cactus. Uh, cactus. Yo, you haven't seen cactuses in forever. Yeah. Cactus, bro. You take them out the bag. Yo, you when was the last time you see some pull out a pair of cactus? Uh other than pain 82, nobody oh, else, bro. Oh my goodness. See wearable. That's the thing, man. Them things last forever. Super wearable. Oh man. You got the mochas around or the um UNCs? UNC. The pros? UNC what? Foams? Foam posit pros. Oh, no, not not definitely not down here. That's that's okay. a unicorn right now. That's a unicorn right now. They, they, I wish yeah. they bring those back. They bring brought back the dooms. I wish they brought brought back those in the most joints. Yeah, I, I messed up with those dooms, man. I, I really messed up with those dooms. They went to the outlets. I should have grabbed you know, them. I say them. this with love. I say this with with, with love, Alpha. But why that's, do that's people say phones are so expensive, right? But then they buy three hundred and fifty dollars Yeezys. I don't think phone posits are, are that expensive. Thank you. Thank They're you. not that expensive, guys. Y'all buy spend... an Yeezy yes, three fifty that cost more, and it's just a knitted upper with a with a sole. Henry, <laughs> yo, this is the thing that I was saying. Like... Oh boy, <sighs> this was an outlet pair, Henry. Twelve dollars. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? Dollars, Jersey Gardens, and 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 so, Fifth New Jersey. You know we 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 gotta stay we gotta stay connected, bro. <laughs> you find stuff like that. <laughs> Yo, you got any one one twos in there? Um, nah, upstairs. Okay. Yeah, I know the Air Force are upstairs for sure. Um. That's a dream sneaker. Any of those one one twos, man. I always love the those. LeBron eight one one two, bro. The seven. See, Le LeBron seven was my favorite silhouette. So I probably had at one point every single pair. Sam no, you I did. Had. You did. Sam I remember. The only one I did not have, I believe, is that all black everything. The, the triple black. We were just talking I about that. that. <laughs> Me, yo, uh, we were just talking about that with Chilltown. Shout out to Chilltown. Um, 
Chill that's, that's there he is right there, yo. Bro, uh, my goal one day is to grab every single triple black LeBron ever made. But to find it in our size, you know, that's gonna be you want a bunch of referee shoes. I just love the triple <laughs> black pair, bro. All I love black. triple oh, black. Please. I don't know what it is. Every LeBron all black. <laughs> <laughs> Chill town. You have the ref. The rock rock the fire. I don't know what it is about. You gotta like, watch this from the beginning. This one, a lot of LeBrons were shown in this episode. I don't know what it is, bro. I don't know what it is about triple black. It's just, bro. It's just dope. That's that's your thing, huh? Wait, I think. I yeah, that right it. there, or like, kind of. I guess it's kind of fell off all red or all purple. Those are my my thing. I like monotone colors sometimes, most of them. I think or I, I, I got a. I think in this room I have a pair of triple black LeBron fours. Oh God! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they in here somewhere. But oh they, God! They in a I gotta go with those. <laughs> I'm telling you now, man. I'm gonna this get is the back second, in here. This is the second. The LeBrons he got. He got some LeBrons, bro. He's the no, he's the third person I know now. I think Chilltown has a pair. Shout outs to my boy Socratic Minds. He has another pair. And now he has a pair of the yeah, black. Just, like, yeah, the black fours. Bro, I, I have, found I two of them, and both of them are completely beat. One, the tabs is ripped off, oh, and a dude is trying to sell it for 200 Never. And then the other one, the whole toe box in like the toe area is tore up. You could tell he was playing basketball with them. Nah, mine like, is oh my god, mine is this. No, I, no. I don't even bring it up in the conversation if it's not crazy. Um, I mean, yeah. if you ever want to let him go, my IG is the same as <laughs> <laughs> look, man. I got, I got, I got so many, man. And then I forget about the storage unit, yeah. That, that's, oh my god. that's a whole nother world, like. That uh, um, I've had that's, my fun. Let's that's <laughs> a pair I never had. That's a pair I always wanted, and I just can't find in my size. Right? And what, the, the, the fours, yeah, the all black fours, bro. I got them. Yeah, but that's the thing. A lot of people have them, and the ones that are in good condition, nobody wants to let go. I don't care. Better save that money, Henry, that you got from off the, the more off white joints. <laughs> <off -white. laughs> I'm about to send me some off whites, right? You better put that money in your pocket and wait for a holler back. Hey, oh, man. like I said, I'm trying to see, Dells, you in the Bronx? What? You said you in the you in Florida or the Bronx? Nah, I'm in North CAC now. Oh, now you in North CAC? Okay. Um, I know you remember this pack. Mm. Oh, damn. The Burrows, right? Burrow pack? Yeah. That Brooklyn. That was Ooh. Gold, right? I'll be honest with you. I don't remember that pack. Oh, yeah, boy. they had the five Burrows. The five Burrows of New York That was City. by Cork, right? Cork did those? Yeah. And yeah. those are my colors, bro. Yeah. But I, I, I didn't understand the, 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 some of the covers they did. Yeah, I, but you know Nike be doing that sometimes. It makes no sense with certain colors or why is that color for that area? I, I had the Chanel swoosh though, man. That was dope. Yeah. It was a dope yeah. pair. Of kicks. The, the only one that I was looking for, and I recently found a dude that had them, was the the Staten Island. Was that the the um the green and yellow jump off? Or no, no, that was um Queens. Queens, okay. Um. The, right um, it was Syracuse colors, the Staten Island, so navy, okay. white, and orange. Uh huh. Yeah, but the guy he was trying to get, he was trying to get like three hundred or something for him. I'm like, come on, man. Yeah. This is, this is me. We're not doing that. That's Look. when they did the midnight <laughs> release. It's still on Nike. I remember buying them things at midnight. This right here was a this was a Jordan sample that I was given that actually released. But these these lows. 
Mm. And these are joints where this thing came out or something. Yeah. Like on the bottom. But in the Carolina colorway, I never did anything with them. They mm -hmm. still here. You know, look like bowling shoes. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You know, but this is an actual sample. So um, I remember getting um, the UNC 13 samples from Packer Shoes mm. for 300 bucks. Wow. Selling. Shout out That's to Packer crazy. Shoes, man. T-Neck, New Jersey. You know where Packer Shoes originated? Yonkers. Yep. His yeah. old man. Yeah. His old yeah. man ran that shoe. Shout out to my boy Hip Dog who had that collaboration with Jay Kiss. I'm gonna get him on the show in a couple of weeks too. Okay, Hip Boy? Hip a uh, hip dog. Oh, hip, okay. Many styles. Yeah. Yonkers legend. Yeah, man. It's just it's been uh it's been a hell of a ride with these these, these shoes, man. I know I would have never imagined. You know, 20 years ago, I, I remember my mother asking me when I was back home, I had a wall of shoes in my room. Before I even left home, I had a wall from the floor to the ceiling, the whole wall. So what you going to do with those all these shoes? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I, I don't know. Mom, but, you know I it, love it, bro. I they, love it. They multiply. You, so, so you... How do you... Have you gotten... Have you slimmed your collection down a little bit? I know a lot of... Heads Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, the the problem is that I would start to open boxes and see damage to shoes that were brand new. Yeah, same so, here. Dude, I had a pair of Watch the Throne Nines. Don't the tell whole me. soul was brown. Oh, my God. And I'm like, what? but you got to remember, people people confuse samples and they think sample is the most high quality thing. It is exactly what it it says. It's a sample. Sample. It yeah. is not made from the best materials. That's going to go to the production pair that they want you to pay for. Yeah. So, this so is a an lot idea. Of those, the samples is an idea. Mm -hmm, pretty much, and that's why they mm -hmm. they make them as wear test samples, and they seed it to different people. They want you to go out and wear them and, and see what happens to the shoe. Are they going to mm -hmm. fall apart? Does this suede hold up? We need to change something. So, and it's not always made from the best material. But when those shoes turned brown, the sole. You know I'm, what? I had to pick. You know what? I remember having the Kobe, the Kobe 5. That was the one, the red, chill red with the wood grain, right? Was that the Kobe 5 All Star? It was, I think it was the Kobe 5. Um, and that sure. came out with the blue, blue LeBron 7 around that time. Okay. Remember? It okay. was around that time. It had brown on the on the shank plate and by the outsole a little okay. bit. And I I sold them because of that because I said, "Yo, what the, what the hell is this shit?" You know? Yeah, yeah. I What's mean, this like like mold or something? And dude, I've had shoes where it, it started just like a crystallization just forms on the side, like white, right? Almost yeah. like or, yeah, or, or black turns ashy, and it's just like. What, what, what was a heartbreak is that I opened up a box of, of dead stock um, Jordan 3, the cement mm -hmm. joints, and the shield was cracked. The whole shield was just split. And it was like, oh, man. So that's when I realized, you know what, this stuff cannot last forever. So that's when, you know, I start to slim things down. And then I, I, I moved a couple of times. I'm like, I can't keep paying these movers to move all this stuff every time. Dude, I had a big-ass truck, bro. Freaking, when I moved from New York to um, North Carolina three, four years ago, man, you don't understand the truck that I had. And they look at me like I was crazy, my neighbors. They never realized how many sneakers I had. So I left, and they were like, "Holy, you have a store in there." I, I moved like five hundred. Yeah. I remember shoes. when I moved when I moved to Maryland. Um, luckily, my mother in law at the time, uh, 
she she had a friend who did shipping. You know, he was a truck driver. Oh wow! You so up. she she was able to get my pairs up here. He came. Up. I literally left down in Florida. I left over 150 pairs of sneakers, and I brought with me maybe a good 20 pairs because I downsized even down there. And then coming up here again, it started growing again, you know, because I started getting my plugs up here. And, and I um, and I still got shoes in New York. I still got shoes in my sister's house. <laughs> like, like shoes were, when I first left home, it's still shoes there. So, um, and I told her I need them. That's how many, how many shoes you think you got right now, dude? Me? Yeah. I still probably got a couple thousand. Jesus. A couple Christ. thousand. Yeah. Yo, when I downsized from. You realize you got a couple of thousand? <laughs> yeah, you got a couple of thousand. When I downsized from 300 to 100, I was like, felt good, y'all. That's I crazy. Wish. Yeah, a thousand. I wish. I'm having a hard time getting rid of sneakers because. I want to trim down, but when I look at them, I say, I can't do it. I just I'm with you, bro. It. I like take I would... the box. I'm like, what can I get rid of? I'll grab this box, pull it up, and then I'll look at it, and I'm like, nah, I can't. I can't. I can't separate from it. Yeah, I, 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 the same thing with me, bro. And then some of these will never When they start them. leaning. Yeah, lean back. The, the, the They're doing a the fat job. The lean back, you don't, bro. You don't, you don't want that, man. You don't like. That's like, what mine's doing right I, here, bro. I've, I've had so many pairs that I, I will be, I will be glad to have. If I could just have drop fronts of, of what I want and was gonna wear all the time in this one room, I'd be fine. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't miss none of it because again, the older they get. And the longer they sit, the more the de deterioration starts to set in. And then everything is cloudy. And then everything is yellow. And then the soul starts yeah. to separate. And then you'd be like, damn, I should have just got rid of it. Well, you know, if you ever want to get rid of them. He's asking a question. He says, do you guys buy shoes to have? I got over 30 pairs of Jordan 1's all DS. The new generation is about that money. Yeah, and you guys have a response to that? I have four pair of DS sneakers. That's it. Everything's worn. Oh, everything. No. I have to put it on feet. Like, uh, some way, somehow, I put it on feet. Uh, even if it is just around the house, because that will keep the the sneaker, you know, warming up that glue and stretch. That glue stretches and warms itself up. It's it, it it doesn't you know it it's crazy, but it works. And that's how some of my sneakers still look almost DS or still intact is because of that. Um, well, my problem is that I have too many shoes to ever. Yeah, you do, man. Three over so, a thousand pairs. Yeah, <laughs> I, like again, you, I, although, you know, you got stuff in the sitting there. And and again, so the thing is for, for a long time, you know, I, I worked in suit and tie. So yeah. you can wear them shoes during the week, oh, no, like you going to work or, or stuff like that. So they sit there, you know? Oh, man, I, that's one thing I hated when I was younger because one of my first jobs was working at um, Hacks. If y'all remember Hacks, it was part of, like, uh, Strawberry and Lord and & Taylor. Um, they, I was working there for – I worked there for, like, two years. And all you do is wear suit or you either go in a suit or you go in – you know, a tie with a vest and, a, and, 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 you know, you couldn't go with nothing that's sporty, no sneakers, nothing. Right. Right. And now I would work there like every, like every day. So it was like, I never had time. So even then, I, I mean, back then I only had about a couple, maybe like 50 pairs uh -huh. and still like, man, I got rid of a lot of stuff back in the days for only like a hundred bucks, bro. And then, like I'm talking about, like Shadow Ones, like 2001 Shadow Ones, mm -hmm. the 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 uh, Royals, them 17s, all the 17s that had almost every color. Uh, I sold somebody a pair of Royals for for 200 bucks. Oh man, uh, I yeah, sold mine for 100 bucks back then. 
Um, and but the thing is, I got them from Foot Locker for like sixty bucks. Yeah. So I, I'm not wasn't gonna, and it was somebody who I, it was my guy Curtis from the Dunk Exchange. Yeah. So you know they they used to always take care of me at those oh, shows. So yeah. you know it's like I wasn't gonna hit him over the head. It's things always come back, man. I was always fair, even with Dells. I, I gave him yes. stuff he got for me for for love prices. So. Um, I, I, I got that kind of karma. Um, mm. I feel like when I would link up with a, a store manager who, who knew and understood that, oh, he's not the flipper, you know what yeah. I'm saying? He's not. That's how my plugs were. And flip it. So that's how my plugs were. Like yeah. I, I got that connection with a couple of, unfortunately, you know, time goes and they grow out of working at the foot lockers right. or working it. So, you know, they leave, um, mm -hmm. But a lot of them, that's the bond that I got with them. They're like, yo, he's not a reseller. I can right. trust him. They're like, listen, bro, just fill out a normal just for I won't get in trouble because of the policy. And just fill out the raffle ticket and it's still yours. You know what I mean? Mm. That way they can't come back at me and be like, why did you sell this pair without a raffle? You know what I mean? I, I had that connection where I would still go there. They will even call me sometimes in front of the line where the, the people were lining up for the raffles. Be like, yo, Here's your raffle ticket. You forgot it when you came earlier. Like it was like some funny stuff, but I'm like, yo, and, and, and some of the people that knew me, they were like, hold up, bro, you weren't here earlier, you know? <laughs> but you know. Ooh. Oh man, I saw those. Like, oh. Dontrell Willis. Dunk high. Bro, and the I haven't seen somebody pull one of those out in ages. Any of that year, that old era. Crazy. Your man PJ Tucker asked me, "What are those?" I said, "Oh man!" I said, <laughs> I said "If you don't know, <laughs> you know." But then again, it just God, it just shows what was happening back then. And there's a couple of pairs of these flowing around in here. Yeah, it's only a couple. I've not no, seen I too mean, many of them. I mean, floating around in this room. <laughs> Oh damn! All right, well, yo, definitely listen, listen, listen. Yo, now oh. you understand why I said, "Oh man, he's here." <laughs> but I mean, he is, I just, I just, I just, I just started following you, bro. We gonna go in that other room, man. He gonna come live, come on here live, for and, and show the other stuff. He got it because this thing, this is just appetizing. All right, it's just you know. He got a lot of he great needs, shoes, man. Does he I needs like his him. own? He needs his own showcase, like nah, he did with me. Yeah, oh yeah, but I, yeah. I'm he like, needs YouTube. He don't want to do no YouTube. I don't oh, think. Man. Maybe I he will. I, 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 oh, look up my soul to keep on YouTube. Oh, you have a YouTube? Yes, wow. I haven't posted on there in probably seven years. So you're gonna imagine what I did post on there back then. Yeah, oh, yeah, I can only imagine. That I was preparing to take to Cleveland's Got Soul. Yeah, dude, when Look you met that Cleveland Got Soul and the Dark Exchange, those are throwbacks yeah. right there yeah. in itself. Because I pulled out every shoe that I was going to take to the Cleveland Got Soul event. And then I wound up getting sick right before the flight and I couldn't go. Damn, dude. Yeah, but those, that will give you a great uh, idea of what I was working with back then. Yeah, you had a crazy collection, man. Yeah. You still do. Yeah, yeah. When I ran into your Instagram again, I was like, yo, I haven't seen him in forever. I was like, you know, yeah. I had to hit you up right away, you know? I was low for a while, you know? Yeah, you were. Then some people, you know, they kind of forgot about who, who put them where they was at. Like, you know, I'm like, wait a minute. I you got all those from me, like, you know, like, yeah, you you got some crazy, crazy kicks, man. I mean, I bought out a lot of LeBron sevens for Cleveland. Oh, those are some good shows. Shout out to Kevin Kramer with that whole Cleveland Got Soul movement. You know? Yeah, that was a big deal back in the days, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the Kixbo guys, Kixbo, Kixbo, Kixbo in Houston, right? Dallas. Dallas, yeah, Dallas. Everyone out there. Yeah. See, look at his channel, man. Oh, shit. I brought it. Today is, today, 
Today is rest in peace, uh, Big Pun's birthday. There's yeah, birthday. rest in peace. Yes, sir. Yeah, this is your channel, bro. Yeah, it is. Look, say it's Stewie's. It is, sir. Made you look. Jesus, man. That sounds, yeah. That's yeah. fire, man. Yeah. If, if it was a size 14, it was mine. Because there were multiple, is what I'm trying to tell you. Yo, you know they're going to bring those back one day, too. You Good. know this, right? That'll be great. Because they won't, I won't have no more left. <laughs> <laughs> they come in, they will come back. They Terrific. will come back. I hope I will so. bet. If they can. Oh. Where'd you go? <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about reviving the channel, but I'm, you know, I don't. I, don't I mean, know. you know, you know, we're, we're, we're in a pandemic right now. Put it this way I see it. Like, why not? You know, we have the time. We have a little bit of time that can get us away from thinking about the pandemic and what's going there and use but this. I don't have the time. That's okay. The thing, okay then, then. I, I, now I got to work from home. So, <laughs> so, um, and, you know, you want to do things the right way. I wouldn't want to do a halfway job at it. So, yeah. I mean, it's something to think about and still consider. But I would go a whole different direction, and 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 I feel like I'm gonna go in a direction that the youth doesn't want, like because I'm but, I'm not here to please them, you know. Well, can I be honest with you, bro? Yeah. There is a lot of people like us out there, bro. Like that's mm -hmm. what my channel is about. Yeah. I've met a lot of guys who come in here who are not about what is the hype, who mm -hmm. are not about this and that. No, uh, you can ask Dells. We've seen. In our channel, we've seen some crazy sneak that I've seen in a while. And, okay. bro, it's nuts. Oh, man. No, and that's man. the OG one, right? Yes, sir. Oh, man. Look at when the video was shot. I didn't, I didn't see. I, I just I just saw it right now. Oh, look. I'm looking at the Heroes Pack, bro. <laughs> right now. <laughs> I held on to the trinkets over the years. <sighs> Oh man, bro! Bro, the crazy thing is that sneaker. There was some sizes that were going for like over three grand, bro. And now they Tell sat, they Tell sat in some that. stores. Exactly. That's why you don't hold on to stuff like that. Don't do it. <laughs> and I believe they're gonna bring back that hardwood classic blue pair. <sighs> The blue suede one. Yeah, they, they supposedly um there was supposed there was a rumor also that before the year ended, we were supposed to get the uh what is it, Saint Germain eights? But yeah. I don't know what happened with that. I haven't heard anything yet from there. I still um, got some I got I still got some nice eight samples, some nice Tarazi. Mm, yeah, I you have that on your YouTube channel, I think. Yeah, I, I still got them. Yo, so I had I had some issues with the audio. Um, so let me ask you a question. I just you just seen those uh, shoes on on the screen. Did you ever think they would actually release those? I had a feeling that some of them would release at some point. Um, and it's funny because they've released the the less popular pairs. Like if I was if I was Nike, I would have released the the Heroes pack. Yeah, like the bread and the and the uh, yeah, I, 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 the, those would not sit around. Mm -mm. But we don't know what is coming down the line. Especially the one they were in the set is if they released the uh, the Jordan one or the Heroes pack. Yeah, but so, I thought that the I thought that shoe, man. I always wanted that shoe. Like I too. remember, I remember being with Mayor and having them in my hands. Mm -hmm. And I was like, yo, I hope one day I can get these Fairfax. And and Mayor and me are the same size. And I was, oh. like, begging him, like, please work with me, bro. <laughs> and he was like, nah, I got you on another one. You know, with his yeah, like, something else. <laughs> I got you on something else. I mean, I was so wanting that pair. So, like, that that was that's, like, one of my favorite releases of the year. I don't care if it's that. Right. It, it's one right. of my it's favorite releases. That. I've been wanting that shoe since I was literally – Holding it in front of Mayor that shoe and all the other sevens he had, and I'm like, 
yo, I, I, this is one of my favorites out of all the samples. Those in the hardwood classics, like, are right. Insane. So, what, what you got to think about is this you see what they're doing to these Jordan one colorways, how many different colors they have come up with mm -hmm. just in the last few years. Now, think about it. They've already done that work with the LeBron 7. So they don't even have to come up with the colorways. They could just release them randomly in the next three years. The work is already I mean, done. Pen. <laughs> so, yeah, I do expect them to drop some more of them. I don't yeah, think I hope that, I've heard hardwood classics. I heard those. Yeah, next year. Next and year. That, it's funny. I wore those. So Cleveland's got soul the year the the first no um that was the Cincinnati show it was the Cincinnati show and I mean the cameras were going off crazy man it was like the red carpet they were what was the um, Brick Street show Super Friends or something yeah Remember? that's in Atlanta yeah he had a dope show too yeah I've never been out to that um. Yeah, I remember though the, the the Dallas one. Shout out to the dude on um, Colt, Sam yeah. Colt. Yeah, Sam Colt. He's a remember guy. him. I know Sam. Sam is Sam is all right, man. Yeah. Big big time Air Force ones. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But when I think of of Dallas, I remember those those expos, and I remember he would always say, yeah. "You come here, I'm gonna take care of you. You know, we'll go show you around." He was always real yeah. nice. Yeah, if you're man. nice to me, I remember you. Exactly. That's the thing about me. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. so. But that's how it that's how it should be, man. And, <laughs> and now it's all about a nickel and a dime. Like oh even yeah. If, even if I go in the store and I, and I put in for a raffle locally, and they'll be like, "Yo, um, all right, nobody else put in for the 13 or or the 14." You know. But if you buy these, I hold you down. Like what? What are, what are we doing here? Like, so you it's hard to, to even maneuver else. with all this damn technology too. Like, with, with, like it's before you had relationships and they they hold you down. But now it's like the apps and this that, and I got yeah. for my manager and the, the corporate to say we can release <laughs> the pairs and all yeah. this nonsense. Before I'd be like, yo. You got an extra pair, put it to the side. I'm coming through right. in an hour. You know what I mean? Right. Now because it's I, crazy. Because people still don't come pick up those pairs that they went in the ass. No. Foot they don't. They're still, still sitting there at three o'clock or whatever. And then, I mean, then that's when the dirt gets done. Yep. But what are you going to do, man? What's up, fellas? It's been real. Yeah. Thank you for coming by, bro. I appreciate you, man. Yeah, got to go uh, get some sort of nourishment going, man. I just came from working in the house to just right on here. So um, I'm about to call it. Well, um, you see how we, you see how easy it is now, right? Yeah. yeah. So yeah, you come sure. back whenever you're free and, and you, we go through the upstairs room when, you, when you're free. Just tell me. Yeah, man. Yeah. Because I know you got the bangers over there. You got the Funk <laughs> Master Flex drop a bomb. So you need I, to come I leave, through. I leave a lot of stuff in the vault, though. The vault. No, so I, I know. Can't even touch it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. All right, bro. Yo, Amazing. thank you, brother. Have a good night, bro. Man, Much good love. Good you, Henry. No, no. Thank you, bro. That go. Man. We'll be, I'll be in touch. Yeah, yeah. Dope, man. Later. Oh, man. Later. All right, homie. Later, bro. Now you understand, right? You didn't understand when I first y'all didn't understand. I, I like I'm gonna I'm starting to reach out, man, to people that's been in the game for a while because I know a lot of them because I've been in this game for a while. A lot of people seeing the, these new guys, which I, I'm I got no problem with the new jacks that are coming in here. Yeah, but there's a lot of heads that ain't on this YouTube thing. I got a lot of things. And and trust me when I tell you this dude ain't even showing anything yet. Like I, I can imagine that's what I'm saying. A lot of people don't just just the talking about having the whole entire heroes pack is ridiculous. Like it's it's crazy. Mm -hmm. You don't hear that like at a norm. Well, a lot of people right. praise, like, you know, like uh, Mayor's Collection, and, and it's well-deserved, Clark Kent, 
This guy yeah. got great shoes too. And um, as I said, like um, known the guy for ten years, and and we I've been trying to get him on for a while. And yeah. and that's what I'm gonna start doing. I'm gonna start having you know a bunch of people come in, and then if that one guy comes in that I've been trying to get for a while, then I mean I invited a lot of crazy people in here tonight. So that's that's, that's the one thing. That's the one thing that a lot of people forget. There's still a lot of people like us that love sneakers, how it was, you know, and it will never be like that again. And, and no, it will never. The, be internet. the internet destroyed it. Yeah. So you know, it, sometimes even just us three being up here and and talking this nostalgia and talking this stuff can help that one kid who's like, yo. I see what they're talking about, and they start searching themselves and start doing actual work, mm -hmm. like we did when we wanted to find something or we wanted to, you know, know about a sneaker. And then they it probably starts that off, but you know, like you said, all you see in social media is the the, the, the hype stuff and you know, blah blah blah. Man, there's a lot of shoes out there that ah oh, man, yeah, it's insane. Uh, it's it's absolutely insane, um, the the actual heat that um this dude. There's so many people though. This is this guy is just one of many. There's as I said, I mean, there's gonna be a lot of people coming through here. I'm working on, um, uh -huh. and and you guys ain't seen nothing yet. I you know, and uh, oh yeah, shout out to, like, shout out to Wrestling Thoughts. Make sure you all subscribe to this channel, Wrestling Thoughts. It's a mixture of wrestling. And um, comedy, you got there's some funny ass stuff on here. That's nothing to do with wrestling. It's really funny. Subscribe to Wrestling Thoughts. I'm glad you actually caught the live stream. Um, and uh, I'm glad you're able to hang out here tonight, Henry. You know what I mean? Man, no, no. Thank you for hitting me up and letting me know that you were going live because you know how YouTube's been doing. Yeah, they don't. They don't. That's they don't. why I always say, guys, follow my Instagram because. You know, YouTube doesn't notify people, so they I don't. have my Instagram. Follow my Twitter also. I tweeted the link yeah. so you know when I go live. Um, and also, I got to remind people about the new T-shirt that I've had for a little bit now. People are beginning to catch on and pick them up. The Defund Sneakers T for when you catch the L on Sneakers app. We got the Defund <laughs> Sneakers T. We got the, good one, out the Hype T. We got, the, we got some masks. Check that out. It's in the description box below. Pick up a team. Yeah. Show some love. Show some support. I'm, I'm one of the hardest working guys on YouTube. It, say it ain't so, Henry. Am uh, I not putting in a lot of work right now? Yes, yes. Uh, Two streams today. Um, you know, I'm I'm this um Rona woke me woke up a, a monster because I'm I'm streaming. Hey, do what you keep, keep keep doing what you're doing, bro. And, and forget about the number, you know, the number of subscribers, bro. You just keep your low. No, I'm, I'm not even, I'm not, you know, subscribers don't mean nothing. Can no I, more. can I, does, I'm going to tell you something, which is dope. I, you know, I don't have that many subscribers, but I will tell you this. If you go look at my algorithm, the percentage of my viewers is higher than the percentage of the ones that have a million subs. Yeah. The ones that have a million subs, theirs is like their percentage that are actually subbed up to them and if they're, they're that are with the channel is like 40 to like 50% that are not subbed up or not supporting them. And mine is at 86% and no, only 13% that is that not. Is, you know why though? And, and the same thing is going on with my channel. It's performing better than ever now. You know why? Because the live, people want live. Yeah. They don't want to watch reviews as much. They want if this is like live TV right here. You know, yeah. It is live TV. You know what I'm saying? So, so, so I, 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 I'm gonna I'm shout out my boy Perm because Perm Perm brought that to my mind. He's like, "Yo, it's better if you have a hundred people that are there every day with you mm -hmm. than having a thousand that are not." You know what I mean? No, you, that are well, there just... the problem is too. Look, YouTube has changed so much. Oh yeah, and and like I've been here and I've not left. Most people would have hung up it by now, you know what I'm saying? But I just love this too much. It's different now than it was then. You know what I'm saying? Before oh, yeah. someone hits the subscribe button, and then every time you post the video, they get notified. Now 
It doesn't matter how many subscribers you have. The only way you get notified is not only if you hit the bell, you got to thumbs up every video. You got to leave yeah. comments. You got to be interactive in the chat. You got to constantly be talking in the <coughs> chat. If you don't do all of that, YouTube says, okay, they're not into the video that much. We're not going to recommend it no more. Yeah. So that's why like, if you, if you have people that are constantly talking and, and thumbsing it up and leaving the comments and being interactive, then, th then that's how it's popping. That's why I always say when the when the chat stops, it's time to end the show. Like right now, the chat's kind of yeah. quiet, so we gonna get up out of here. No, yeah, think. yeah, no, definitely. I got I gotta go start mines. I was supposed to start mines a long yeah, time yeah. ago. Do you but, think, bro? I'm gonna join you in a minute, man. Thank but, you for coming by, bro. Well, you know, when we get when we get the sneaker stuff going, it's hard. To oh leave, yeah, yeah, man. it was crazy tonight, man. Tonight was crazy. Thank you for coming by, bro. I appreciate. No, thank it, you, man. thank you too, bro. Later, bro. All right, man. Check him out, Henry Mister Eighty Three. And um, guys, I had a blast tonight, man. Um, and as I said, man, we got I got a lot of guests coming, but I want to get things more popping, you know what I mean? And and I see there's a lot of people in here that are uh, wanting to cam up. Some people I let cam up, some people I want to schedule, you know what I'm saying? I don't want it to be like a free-for-all all the time. Everyone that camped up today were invited prior to the stream. So if I have guests that I'm I'm priorly inviting, I'm keeping it that. I invited um say it say it. I invited um oh what's up my Filipino brother right there. Um I invited um who else I invited? I invited uh Fresh Kicks tonight. These are the guys that were and I invited um so on my soul to keep. So these were guests of mine. And Henry, I'm always on his stream hanging out. He's always welcome to do commentary and everything. I thought that was fun to have him another person. I, I enjoy when we have a, multiple guests because then we can do it. But the truth of the matter, when you have too many people at once, everyone's talking over each other and it sounds like crap. It sounds like absolute crap. But um, yeah, man, that's all I got. If you guys have any um, questions for me, I got a minute or two. You can leave it or um, I'm about to be out of here. Um, if you enjoyed the show, we have the cash app, send donations there. The donos are appreciated. We have the super chat still until we're not live. We also have the PayPal running across the screen right there. Show that love. I always shout you out on the next stream, and it is definitely much appreciated. And if you're watching on the playback, right, triple pepperoni mushroom pizza lets me know you watch this entire two-plus hour stream, um, which um, I love it. I, I love it. I, I try to give you guys a boatload of content. I know things suck right now with the Rona and – you know, people people are bored, you know, and, and people aren't able to even interact with each other no more like they used to, right? So it's kind of healthy for us to all interact and, and talk and, and chop it up. Um, I know it's not the same as going out with your friends and hanging out, but um, you guys get what I'm saying at the end of the day. It, it's, it's a nice vibe right here, and I try to keep it that way. And um, thank you all for tuning in. Thumbs up the video, please. If you don't thumbs it up, at least thumbs it down. All right. Show some vibes to me. Give me some vibes. Give me some advice. If there's anything you want on the channel, leave your comments. We have tons of content too. I mean, I'm hitting you with so much content. I don't know if I'm giving y'all too much content. So, um, you know, vibe out with me. I'm, I'm thinking maybe I'm giving y'all too much content. Am I wrong? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. We did a really good video yesterday on um, Supreme being sold. Check out that video. If you're just hanging out right now, you want more, then, then check out that video. You will love that video. Trust me. Uh, we've been following up on everything going on with Warren Lotus, that whole story. We did a stream earlier on these joints, showed you a bunch of on-foot looks, and we talked about this shoe and the whole situation with Dunks. Uh, that was this morning. So check out that stream, too, if you're just hanging out. And... Um, Thank you all for tuning in. Much love out there. We out of here.